rough around the edges there. Although I do need your face. To finish my mannequin for my character. Nothing here. Nothing there. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> continuing forward then. Uh Okay. Fucking Fantastic. Here, catch. Oh. Alright, just don't look down. Don't look down, we got it. Stick oh, fuck. Stick <laughs> <laughs> a little sidetrack there. Yeah, if you want to play, if you want to play Diablo Four, all the power to you. I wiped my eyes, and that motherfucker was right in front of me. Get out of here. Where are we running from? Whatever the fuck that thing is. This just seems too simple. Oh, okay, good, good, good. I'm like, mm, I'm not buying that I'm not supposed to progress forward here. So much gold. Oh, never mind, it's empty. It's so dark on stream for you guys. It's dark for me too. Okay. Is there any more treasure anywhere on my compass? I don't see anything. So I think we're good until we start getting attacked here in a minute. Oh, never mind. It's happening now. It's happening now. It's happening now. Yellow bellied sea snake. That's what they call it. Oh, what? What? man that's true meet him feed him then just breed him oh my god tree <laughs> from your children madness to spare them the world you have created no it's about the same thing well so glad <laughs> that fuck oh you bastard oh It's probably a reason, a very good reason why this door is closed. Do I care? Clearly not. Ooh. What the fuck? What the fuck? What, of all times a game to get choppy, go stuck. Fuck. How dare. Now the game's like smooth as fuck. Like, okay, that was mean. Fuck! <laughs> what the fuck? No! No, 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 no! For the sisters of yep. mercy filled with panic in their eyes rise dead on adrenochrome. Nice. Thanks, Satan. <laughs> all right. Cheers to you all. Here's the adrenochrome. This is going to hurt. Oh, my fuck. Of course there is Satan. Close this fucking door. Fuck. Someone's walking around in there. Oh. <coughs> that fucking hurt my throat. <coughs> Jesus fucking Christ! 
Casey, are you absolutely sure this is what Jason said? Yeah, I think so. Jason still seemed with it when he was telling me. So I don't doubt what he said. Did you say Jason told you who the whistling man is? He did. He said it was a woman. They went to school together. Somebody called me. What? Whoa. What happened? Are we still on air? No. No, we're not. Seems like the power is completely... Oh my god, it's right as I scored hours. That was a weird noise. I guess the dog doesn't come inside. Okay. <laughs> Holy shit! Uh, all right, Mila, I have to eat this this peanut now, and it's gonna be disgusting, and it's gonna be really spicy, and I don't want you to see me like this. <laughs> She's like, what do you mean? Everybody loves you, you know, yet you're afraid of everybody. I don't get it. No, you can't have the peanut. Oh, she found it. Fuck. <laughs> no. No. You can't have the peanut. You would be you would be in misery. On the corners anywhere or sneaking underneath. This is kind of random, but I guess it, it adds something different to the floor. Yeah, no one else can see when we use those. Oh, fuck. Is this like a server room? Oh, no. Okay. I hate that. I hate everything about it. Fucking! Oh, hi there. Where are you going? Oh, fuck. Fucking bitch! I knew something was gonna happen. I fucking knew it. Oh. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh, you son of a bitch! Oh, they're gonna. Fuck! Oh, why? Can opener. What the f Receiver has broken. Uh Okay. Hi! How's it going? Thanks for backing me up back there. What the fuck was that? Oh my god! Jesus, this dude has some kinks that I want. Hi, everybody! Uh, I almost said it was Saturday. Happy uh, Monday. It's the 3rd of July. Um, you'll be hearing lots of fireworks over the next couple hours, I'm sure. Hopefully, just half an hour. We'll see. Um, hope you're all doing well. Hope you've had a good start to the week. Uh, so, tonight, if you haven't checked the schedule, um, we're working with a game that Twy actually played and recommended it, so I grabbed it from Keymailer. Ah! Yo, what's up one time? Oh, you're also telling Nox, uh, fuck Diablo. I'm sure he's gonna be really... Fr <laughs> he's gonna unmod you one of these days, dude. Um, so we're playing The Devil's Face tonight to start off. Uh, got it through key mailer, so I'm excited to see what it has to have in store. Oh, fireworks just started for you. That's nice. Uh, and then we're also playing... I, that is... Is that the name of the actual game? I think I may have typoed that. Hold on. No, it is. Okay, it's Amanda the Adventurer. Um, it's supposed to be a game that is supposed... It's like a knockoff of Dora the Explorer, but it's a horror game. I know very little about it, but I've heard it's, uh, a trip. So that's going to be our, our plan for tonight. Uh, and then late night tomorrow night to make up because I won't be here on Saturday. 
Uh, we're going to try playing Bramble to Mountain King. Uh, why are you whining? Is she whining? Was that you? Oh. The whole family's in here, by the way. Um, so yeah, Tuesday at 10 p.m., potentially later than that, we'll, be, we'll start the uh, Bramble the Mountain King. Uh, I believe it is supposed to be like a Norse mythology version of Little Nightmares, so I'm on board. It's going to be fun. And then Thursday, regular time, we're doing the Rage stream. Uh, it's long overdue. Uh, I bought that new uh, Rage game that everyone's been playing called Only Up that looks absolutely fucking awful. So that'll be fun. And then Jump King, because I haven't played it, and uh, I was inspired to at least try it with uh, Fishboat doing the Jumpathon that lasted all month. You've been unmodded twice in the past three days. Well, I mean, you're asking for it at this point. You keep on the sick <laughs> D20 getting unmodded. Oh, yeah, because you keep getting the crit fail. <laughs> Oh, my word. Um, so that's what we got going on for this week. Uh, again, there's no stream on Saturday. I'm going to be out of town. Uh, let's see. Oh, so you may have, may have forgotten. I sure haven't. Uh, we still have nine more spins to go, because on a good day, twenty-seven go, uh, three goes into 27 nine times. So uh, let's see what I have to die with today. Is it going to work? Oh, it worked first try. Finally. Oh, fuck. I also forgot to get rid of... Uh, I forgot to get rid of the chocolate bar because it's no longer there anymore. Great. Well, this is going to be fun. Do, 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 do. <laughs> no, no, no. Not too skinny, she's not too fat, she's a real humdinger, and I like it like that she's the devil with the blue dress, blue dress, blue dress, up, devil with the blue dress on. Devil with the blue dress on. Alright, uh, so as you can see, we have to do the, the Reaper today. Excuse me, I have to do the Reaper, the rest of you get to sit here and watch and laugh at me. So yeah, this is the Garlic Smoked Reaper from Gonzo Sauce, aka Fear and Loathing in Scoville. Uh, it's rated very hot. Three out of three. It's uh, top three awful ones. What the fuck? Pistine official. Hi, mom. <laughs> my mom finally made it to one of my streams. This is exciting. <laughs> Amanda's waving. <laughs> um. <laughs> Hi, mom. So we're doing... Uh, so in, in the... What is it called again? The Garlic Smoked Reaper Hot Sauce. There is... Oh, garlic. Uh, smoked Reaper Mash. White wine, vinegar, water, avocado oil, fresh lime, juice and zest, mustard seeds, and spices. <laughs> oh, shut up. Wow. Uh, so this is going to be fun. Oh, by the way, don't forget. Uh, if you press the little subscribe button, there should be a checkbox for your Prime. So you can get a free sub. Sounds great. Oh, it's lovely, Jeff. It really is. All right. So, there she is. Cheers to you all, I guess. Oh, boy. Correct. <laughs> What's up? It's, I don't know if it's fun, but it's something. And cheers, everybody. Thanks for being here early and watching this bullshit. Oh. Um, let me update the counter really quick, because I forgot to do that as usual. <clears throat> Three off of that's 24. We're getting there. So for those that don't recall... After the bitathon about a month ago, that number was up to almost 60, making our way down. <laughs> Thank you, Satan. Cheers to you. Oh. Horrid.
that reaper pepper just always oh once the lime juice wears off it's just hell it always makes me wonder who orders this hot sauce and puts it on food like ketchup like yeah i love this shit like what the fuck how do you taste food after exactly how do you taste food after that i don't know i have no idea Ugh. so i've got mila down here to my right your left he's having a grand old time she had a couple cbd cookies and some uh some meds trazodone, trazodone thank you she's gorked out tater's over here just licking everything in sight which happens to be Amanda's chin at the moment. She's not stopping. <laughs> Gross. Ugh. Lime juice and hell, my favorite flavors. Yo, Monster Mom, welcome in. How you doing? Poor baby. Delicious. Delicious. <laughs> Hi, Mrs. Jugs. To <laughs> tree, we don't call her Mrs. Jugs. <laughs> It's Miss Jugs. Tree Beard's Kevin, by the way. Okay, it's Miss Jugs. Huh? It's Miss Jugs. Miss Jugs? We're married. It's Mrs. Oh, wait, me? me? I'm Mrs. Jugs? Oh. I, I'm assuming so. Oh. Okay. Oh, welcome in, Scaredy. I was thinking your mom, but that's weird. Oh, that's true. <laughs> My mom is here, so it could be, it could be both. Yeah, okay, okay, fair enough. <laughs> She's asking, what are you drinking tomorrow? Yes. She says yes. <laughs> oh, Scaredy, by the way, I had you on Lurk at some point. Were you watching Deliverance the other day? I'm about to bust my banjo out that I don't own. But ding 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 ding. Oh. No, it was a movie called The Creeper. Oh, it looked like Deliverance. Yeah got me any good oh, i need more chapstick so we have jugs mrs jugs and mama jugs so many jugs all the jugs monster mom oh. it's been compared to deliverance i actually liked it better wow okay interesting so maybe there was just less pig squealing i guess oh boy this is gonna be a spicy burp i'm not ready for it no no it's gone no wait doesn't know what to do ew yeah i'm sweating <laughs> no forced man love thank goodness that's okay that's a plus i'll give you that yeah, the uh, the forced forced love in general is uh, no bueno. Oh, okay. Um, Sling Blade. Was there? There wasn't any forced love in Sling Blade, was there? I know there's like there was domestic violence in that movie. Definitely not something, but yeah, no, that's... Uh, oh, there it is. Like some of them French fried potatoes. Mm. Oh. That hot sauce is so hot, I had to take my slippers off. Oh. Whew. Okay. So, um... I think I'm gonna battle through this. I think we've reached, we've gone past the um the pinnacle, the height of this hot sauce. And my lips are just on fire, that's all. You would need that hot sauce if it will keep me warm inside. I nuclear. <laughs> it melts you from the inside out. <laughs> Might as well drink gasoline. Um so yeah, we're gonna be starting off tonight with the devil's face. Uh got this uh Key through key mailer so uh big shout out to key mailer the devs pr um whoever's in charge for uh letting us give this game a shot my understanding is that it's actually a demo and the game doesn't come out until 
September, I think it was. Uh, which is funny because it appears like the game's done um, in terms of like the packaging and everything. So it must be a really nice demo. Um, and then whatever time we have left, we have Amanda the Adventurer, which again is like Dora the Explorer, but it's apparently very creepy. So we'll see what happens. <clears throat> uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm not doing any more spins. That one hurt. <laughs> not as bad as other ones, but it fucking hurt. Uh, so follow me over. Let's go. Mo! Welcome in! <laughs> what in the fuck? <laughs> They're all laying on the ground together. Um, game story or new game? Which one do I click on? Why does this look familiar? Um, I don't know. Have you played it, Scaredy? I'm gonna click on Games Story and see if that does anything. Oh! Oh! It gives you the back... Okay, it's the background of the game, and then you press New Game... Mm. Jonathan, our hero. Second generation Christian Orthodox immigrant. He and his brother, Christian... Wait. <laughs> It's a lot of Christians involved here. He and his brother Christian were involved in a car accident. Jonathan, the driver, was able to escape from the burning vehicle, but Christian was not so lucky. Now he's a crispy. <laughs> Tragically, Jonathan watches his brother burn to death. Damn. Racked with, racked with guilt over not being able to save his brother and haunted by strange visions, Jonathan decided to end his own life. That's fucked. However, this began his journey to the afterlife, where he will be judged for his actions and forced to live eternally in the hell he has created for himself. The Devil's Face is based on the beliefs of an existing pagan sect and, quote, the Book of Demons, accounts of the afterlife. It is aimed at players who want to experience a horror game with a deeper meaning. Well, at least in this concept, it's not like the bad guy has a mental illness, because that's been getting kind of old of late i have to say currently have slime green dye and what little hair i have left after a fresh cut lol gonna hang while i wait all right well thanks for being here mo no definite haven't played this huh christian the christian crispy christian the christian hopefully it was it wasn't christian slater that would be a travesty <laughs> so old <clears throat> all right let's give this thing a shot huh your choices have led you to where you are now. It's true. Hey, hey, kid, what's up? Welcome in. Hope you're doing well, my friend. But still tasty. My entire chart is off by 1 16th of a note. Ugh. The place you will see when you die is the only you have chosen for yourself. Oh, tree. This game may cause epileptic shock. It contains real images of exorcism, religious symbols, and violence that may disturb some players. Additionally, the game features real locations and stuff that I can't read quick enough because they move the text off the screen. Please note this game is a work of fiction. Any resemblance to actual events, persons, places, or situations is purely coincidental and not intended to represent reality. Are these people okay? Who? Who are we talking about? <laughs> I'm doing good, kid. Chapter after... Jesus. Uh. Alright. Hold up. I gotta turn that music down. Like that, whatever that noise is in my ear is too loud. That's slightly better. Please note the fact this game is here to scare the shit out of you should be a warning for a horror game for real. Oh, well, thank you, skeleton. Uh. Okay, basic movement. Wazed. Look with mouse. H is focus? Why is it H? I'm changing that to right click. Left shifts run, left controls crouch, changing that to C, jump a space, tabs inventory. Okay, I need to change that. That is awful. Uh, where is it? Crouch. C. C. Oh. C. Uh, that's good. That's good. Oh, now there's more commands that they didn't tell us yet. So maybe there is a right mouse. Oh, there's toggle fires right mouse button. Fuck. 
Why does it have to be H? Because it's oh my god, there's so many more. All right, fuck that. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. It's too much work. <clears throat> oh, it's up twice. Change to F. F for focus. Oh, thank you, skeleton. Okay. I didn't realize that F was available. No, F is lighter. Why are you doing this to me? Oh shit, you're playing this. I'm a post in their Discord. Oh, thanks, Twy. I don't apply it directly to the forehead. <laughs> What's up, Brian? Welcome in. That's going to be on my mind all night now. Thank you. <laughs> That's a lot of stuff. Lighter is F. Yeah. I'm just going to go. There are actually too many controls for horror game. Uh, you know, there's, there's an abundance. We'll say that. So we'll just keep walking. The Book of Demons updated. Tap to check. The Book of Demons. When your soul is judged by the guardians of the two worlds, the place you will face is the one you created for your own sake. Anubis, 4721. Anubis? That's an Egyptian god. Oh, check it out. It's a giant tree. Is this like the opposite of Yggdrasil? It's quite bright. D-A-S-U Domine. Doma A-S Requiem. Whack! I don't think I used most of the buttons. <gasps> the fuck was that? Oh, I'm being judged. Yeah, the feather in the heart. Your soul has been judged. Yeah, I see that. Damn, you got brightest <gasps> mortal. Hey, hey, who are you? Hello? Chapter, Dark Path. Okay. How to get rid of a demon. Smack them with a fucking boot. I mean, that's an option, isn't it? Ah, uh, this must be the tunnel from Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Uh, <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Oh! I'm at uh, the River Styx. I'm on the boat. This is Karen, isn't it? Or Charon. Who are you? I have many names, but none of them can describe my true form and my true purpose. Thanks. That really helps. Can even give me one of them. Where am I? I said, where am I? This is where everything begins and ends, okay? Where is my body? It was the salmon moose? Oh, gross. Quick, clap their cheeks. <laughs> Six was very entertaining, for real. <laughs> you left your body at the hospital where I took you. After all, where you were going, you don't need it. Well, okay. I'm pretty sure his name is Craig. <laughs> it might be. Where are you taking me to? Where you, where you choose for yourself to go? We're going to Disney World? Can I go? I want to hang out with you. Can I... Can I approach you? Oh, I can't. Okay, I can. Can't move. But I'm pretty sure one of the names he uses is Karen. C-H-A-R-O-N. Not K-A-R-E-N, like with the bad haircut. Wait, how much knowledge do you have in Greek mythology? No one knows Craig 2.0 anymore. <laughs> Chapter, The Denial. Where the fuck are we now? Oh, God. That entire room behind me is dark as fuck. All right, here's lighter. I, don't, I didn't have to pick up the lighter first, apparently. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's lighter fluid. Uh, no, no, I did not want to do that. Oh, fuck, I didn't, okay. There we go, let me get a key. I can use this key to open the door. I think I need to right click on the door. Oh, okay. Inventory's tab, game boss. Watch out for the lighter, it is running out. Oh, fuck, fuck, no, okay. The Book of Demons gives you hints. Um, how do I move over? Won't let me. Okay, that's, that's cool. Alright, right click to unlock. Technically, it's right and left. In my bathroom. I imagine that Karen is a Karen. Could be. When I first heard his name, I thought it was Karan. Scroll. You're, you're a scroll. My brother's house? <laughs> Your brother lives in a... Weird house. Can we stop with the static jump scares? You going to bed? Love you. The Book of Demons. As Christ roamed the desolate wasteland, Satan tempted him with the promise of darkness. 
No, you are. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Paintings of Jesus Christ can have different meanings for different people depending on their beliefs, backgrounds, and perspectives. Okay. Or my brother always listens to church music. Maybe there are other stations I can choose from. To change station, I can right click. Listen to Batushka? What is this? Nice, they fixed the typo. Oh, nice. <laughs> love you, love you, love you, love you, love you too. Save me, Jeebus. Buffoon. Batushka or True Batushka? Mm, yes, both. That's the different channels. Huh? Okay. I don't think she wants to hide me. I think she wants to go with you. Mila, why don't you go to bed with Mom? I'm having too much fun in church over here. <laughs> Alright, enough of that. I was hoping for, uh... I thought I could turn that on. I was expecting some hallelujah, hallelujah. Painting of Satan versus God. God's got a fucking hunchback. What the fuck? Painting of Satan versus God. No, this is a picture of me with a trident against Tater out back as she tries to eat Mila's poop. <laughs> oh, a key fell out of that. <laughs> Look at that. Can I get a man? <laughs> no. Hello? Fuck was that shit? Paintings of angels, which I cannot. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. So that thing just like got awkward. All right, cool. Paintings of angels, great. The Christian cross. What the fuck? Really? You couldn't let me have electricity for two goddamn minutes? Just knocking. An old TV with a VCR. For you Zoomers, this is what was before the DVD. <laughs> is Satan a.k.a. Black Phillip, or is Black Phillip a different goat guy? Yes. This, uh, Black Phillip was a, uh, another name, like, you would call, like, Satan, Lucifer, um, Belial, all that shit. 18 plus stream, someone can, can get their toddler. <laughs> wow, same guy. You know you're in an old person's house, they have toilets. <laughs> Oh, Jazzy, I know all the monikers. I'm super clueless. I mean, this is impossible. Wait. Oh, great. So this game's like PT? Okay, just changed. Oh. Thank God I'm not old. <laughs> um, so the only reason I know about the term Black Phillip because it's something that existed back in like, the medieval times into like the renaissance era and then kind of fizzled out into like the i guess really like the expand like the expansion like moving to the west like into the sea like that whole era of time uh it was a term that was used to describe the devil was black philip um and they used that obviously in the movie the witch which is a big black goat Yes, exactly. Exactly, Mo. <laughs> so that's where he got his name from. Uh, Black Phillip was actually a true, like, name that people would use to describe the devil. The eerie echoes of chance pierce through the veil of darkness, disturbing the creatures lurking within its shadowy depths. Too fucking rad, oh my god. Wait, how do I, uh... Oh, so I have to go and select it to use it. Okay. Painting of Divine Infant. Jesus Child. Jesus Child. 
Jesus Christ his disciples. Painting of angels. Shut up. Life is like a switch, flickering and threatening to plunge us into darkness with each flicker, but we have the power to keep the lights ablaze, illuminating the path before us even in the bleakest of moments. I guess so. Makes sense. And we've already seen that picture before. Nice plant. Kings of Angels. Our God is an awesome God. He reigns from heaven above with wisdom, <laughs> power, and love. Our God is an awesome God. Our God is an awesome God. He reigns from heaven above with wisdom, power, and wisdom. love. Our God is an awesome God. Lift it up. Lift it up. Get it, Brian. Oh. I heard my brother staying in the room for hours. I really admire his faith in God. What the fuck? God damn it. Alright, so clearly we gotta bring stuff here. <clears throat> I'm assuming a goblet, uh, some Christ checks, and the Bible. Oh. Yo, what's up, Meg? Welcome in. How are we, friend? I don't know about you guys, but it's very difficult to see anything in here. Why is that so loud? Yeah, I would love to have a seat, thank you. But they won't let me. <laughs> what that was all about. <laughs> ah, we can open drawers. Knowledge. The beginning of the journey, edit inventory. Dark Path. The Book of Demons is in Greece, written by Anubis. Everything you need can be found in this game in various encrypted languages. I show you the knowledge. You grab it if you want. I'm not responsible for anything if something happens to you. Good luck. Well, excuse the fuck out of me. <clears throat> Very dark, yes. Quit pissing off Jesus. <laughs> I'm doing good, Meg. Thank you for asking. Hello, all at Christ checks. One of the very few good fucking jokes that Dan Cook ever did. Yeah, I want to see if I can change the brightness on this. Oh, midge. Um. No. <laughs> and no. It looks like there is no setting for brightness. Have a lovely evening, Mother. I will see you tomorrow. Uh, whenever. I don't know what time you need to be here, but I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Thanks for stopping in. I appreciate you. Hope you get some good sleep, too. A button. Hey! I. It's funny, I didn't actually spin around. The game did that to me. It turned the lights on and opened the door. Is this all a dream? In the unrelenting darkness, a single flicker of light can offer faint hope, but real change can only be made through the presence of two light sources. In the depths of the tortured human soul, having even a little faith in Christ and the Virgin Mary is an absolute necessity for hope to be born. <clears throat> that reminds me of his shirt from tshirthell.com. All it says is Virgin Mary, if you don't count in. <laughs> Point taken. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh. God, that's a perfect fucking clip. Why is this tape here? I'll definitely have to check it out. Of course. And now the TV's on around the corner. Yeah. Alright, I won't go into that closet. True exorcism. We pray for that soul so unjustly departed. Nobody likes this guy. He must have done something real bad. I guess so.
the consistent use of the static, though, tone it back a bit. The brother's biggest fear was being possessed by unholy spirits. This looks like HBO in the 90s when I tried to steal a cable. Take the doily. The song slaps. I'm slowly gonna say. <laughs> What am I looking at? What the fuck? Are they cat videos? They might be. Old episode of Cops. This guy's cracked out. <laughs> Yo, this new Lord of the Rings game is wild. Thanks, but no thanks. Maybe I should read the Book of Demons. Okay, and then around through dark, a single flicker of light can offer faint hope. A real change can only be made through the presence of two light sources in the depths of the tortured human soul. Having even a little faith in Christ and the Virgin Mary is an absolute necessity for hope to be born. Okay. The VHS, who you see is real exorcism in Greece. This is from the community manager. Wow. Creepy. How the hell do you get a hold of that? TV shows from the 80s were crazy. <laughs> All right, so we need to light, make two lights, refill the fluid. Okay. Do I, do I try this again? I do, okay. I remember my brother always had two lit candles on the candelabras as he prayed. Yes. No candle in inventory. Okay, so can I go pick up these candles? I'm gonna need the candles light. N no shit. I want to pick up the candle. All right. So there has to be candles I can pick up somewhere then that are not currently lit. It is not lit, fam. No idea. I didn't ask questions. Oh, that didn't get fixed. What didn't get fixed? Am I supposed to be able to pick those up? Nothing in those. Oh, that door's gone. With that red thing on the floor by the TV? Let's find out. Looks like books. Oh. Use a specific color for Christ. Was it this? Does this one go here? The act lighting the candle holds profound meaning for Christians. It symbolizes the presence of God, serves as a focal point during prayer, and represents the light of Christ. Candles are used to commemorate important events and figures, foster unity among believers, and provide comfort during times of mourning. Overall, the lit candle is a tangible expression of faith, inviting believers to seek spiritual enlightenment and draw closer to God. Okay. 
So we got that. There's one. Let's go find the other one now, right? That's what you gotta do. Type on the notification when it says you don't have a candle inventory. English is not their main language. Oh no, I mean that's fair. Um it does have like it did kind of make sense though, like that I didn't have it um in inventory. Like I get that. It means I had to go find them. I couldn't just pick yeah, you know, like just you know, like pick one out of the air. Alright, where's the other one? Be on the floor somewhere, isn't it? No. Is it behind it? No. <laughs> That'd be something. Okay. I was like, why isn't that working? <laughs> the body just twitches at e e e. Under the Jesus table? That's why I, I looked there, though. See? Oh, do you mean in the other room? I guess it could be there. I didn't actually look. I don't see one down there. Or over here. There's... Oh, there's no any candle inventory. Oh, I get it, Twy. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Reflection on the floor. Yeah, yeah. It's an interesting, uh... Still can't open. It's more for me to do in this room. Ah, oh, I, I agree, but... Maybe you guys can tell me where this candle is. Anything under there? No. Is it in the clock? No, that would be pretty cool. There's no drawers here or anything. And I already checked these drawers. There was nothing in it. Any of the three. Okay. Just gonna walk along the floor and just keep... Oh, oh, right there. It looks like the ones my brother used in his prayer room. Ah, well, fantastic. Let's light it up. I'm on fire! Do they put a fresh coat of polyurethane on every wooden surface? Uh, potentially. More lighter fluid. There we go. What the fuck? Yeah. It... Why does it keep doing that? <laughs> Sometimes one must extinguish the lights and confront their deepest fears with unwavering courage. Only in darkness of the most harrowing. That wasn't one of you? Yo, oh, what's up, Disconnected? Welcome in. This way is totally safe. Yeah. Only in darkness are the most harrowing truths revealed, and only by facing them directly can one hope to overcome the, de the demons that lurk within. Okay. Listen to Satan. He speaks to you. The word is law. Everything... <laughs> I couldn't even scream. Perhaps I need the candle's light. Yeah, perhaps. Why isn't this... What the fuck? I keep hitting right-click and it spins me around. I have to do this... Wait... Do I do this one first, then? No? <laughs> ah, extinguish the fires. Right, right, right. Claw is the law. Scratch me, puppy. <laughs> I mean, what? Bird is the word. Bird, bird, bird. But the bird is the word.
we have an update. When one encounters Christ face to face, the veil of falsehood is violently torn asunder. Okay. And this dark reality of existence is laid bare before them. In that moment of divine reckoning, all illusions are shattered, and the soul is exposed in its nakedness to the unyielding light of truth. This game is fucking loud. Uh, now we're back in here again. All right, let me read this one more time. When one encounters Christ face to face, the veil of falsehood is violently torn asunder, and the stark reality of existence is laid bare before them. In that moment of divine reckoning, all illusions are shattered, and the soul is exposed in its nakedness to the unyielding light of truth. Okay. They covered another when I was an altar boy. If you were too busy covering something else. Okay, well, I had the right idea of looking at the picture of Christ, because I just found a fucking key. Avoiding your problems may seem easy, but it's not sustainable. Running away from them can lead to even bigger issues in the long run. It's important to confront your problems as soon as possible, even if it's difficult. By facing them head-on, you can take control of your life and move forward with greater clarity and confidence. Okay. Okay. So face the issue. Whatever happens, I have to face something head on. So that means something's about to walk around the corner and scare the shit out of me, and I have to just keep staring at it or something. Okay. See, if every jump scare didn't have the, the static bit... <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. Maybe I need a key. Okay. This is the advanced class of Satan. Yeah. This isn't just any old ordinary day darkness. This is advanced darkness. I believe there's more for me to do in this room. Why is that candle lit down there? I don't like this. Oh. Interesting. Lights came so far, but the lighter, the lighter being so dang, dang break bugs me. Oh, bright. Yeah, it's extremely bright. If I'm not mistaken, this is their first game and it is done by two brothers. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, they definitely used, like, the same, um, there's a lot of, like, Emeka games, like, I don't want to say assets, but there's, like, a lot of similarity, I guess. Where the fuck is this other key? I don't have another tape to watch. I looked through there. Oh my. Ah, static. Fuck. <laughs> oh no. It's filled the god juice. That's why it's so shiny. Oh my god. Uh, this isn't good. A strange satanic symbol. static thing i swear to fuck what distinguishes us from bad people is it our actions beliefs or values it's easy to judge others but we should also reflect on our own behavior that's fair <laughs> except now it's upside down oh that's this door Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Satan. Ah. Uh. Um. 
Okay. Mistakes are an integral part of the human experience. Throughout your life, you are bound to make several mistakes. Oh, yeah. However, the crucial aspect is to use these mistakes as opportunities to improve oneself and learn valuable lessons. Rather than dwelling on these missteps, allowing them to hold you back, it is essential to confront them head on by opening the metaphorical red door. By facing your mistakes and accepting them, you can release yourself from the burden of the past and move forward towards a brighter future. Through this self-reflection and acceptance, one can gain true personal growth and achieve their full potential. Fair enough. Let's head towards the red door. God. I feel like I'm in a dream running as fast as I can, but it's like I'm running like this. Bing, 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 bing. Can we maybe right the ship here so I can walk through the door properly? Wait. Chapter Lost Hopes. Okay. This is a lot of chapters for a demo or a beta kind of impressive no fucking way lighter added to equipment coin added game saved okay so 50 euro cents okay prayers are not heard in the dark that's something I'll make sure to keep a light on oh fuck <clears throat> what truly sets us apart from being labeled as bad individuals is that merely our actions beliefs their values the intellect and introspection and self-reflection while it's effortless to pass judgment on others it's crucial to delve deeper into our own behavior do we perceive ourselves as flawless or infallible it's something to fall into this trap of self-righteousness, convinced that our perspective is the sole truth. Yet this mindset blinds us to our own shortcomings, hindering personal growth and development. Is this a Sunday school demo? <laughs> Maybe. Whoa. Yo, nice digs, my dude. I like this place. Yo, what's the rent like here? At least the electricity isn't that expensive. Oh, hey. My dude. Best Zillow listing ever. <laughs> Are they playing Gregorian chants backwards? That's what it sounds like. Oh, yeah, just close this off. That's cool. Hey, bud. Hello, friends. I've, uh... I've come to... Learn? Hey, bud. Oh, I know that face. They used a similar asset from that of the dude from Prognostic. But they, uh, they altered it. Really cool looking. Why are you all sad? This house rules. The coolest frat house ever. You guys don't understand. I'll 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 talk to the big guy. We'll get a kager next week. It's all gonna go well. Someone have a case of the Mondays. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. That was unacceptable. Ah, uh -huh, get fucked. Thanks, Nox. Appreciate you. I believe there's more for me to do in this church. Okay. Like, maybe grab whatever this was that I didn't see until now? Orthodox Church, add its inventory. Oh, my word. Can I please? Thank you. 
All Orthodox Christians who enter the church can, if they wish, offer coins or banknotes to financially support the church. Uh -huh. After taking candles and lighting them, they place them in designated positions, manually, usually in front of the icons of the saints. Behind the act of lighting the candle, there's a deeper symbolism. One, to glorify God, who is the true and only light that enlightens every person. Two, to dispel the darkness of the night and con confront us from the fear of darkness. Three, to show that we have joy in our souls. Four, in honor of the saints and martyrs of our faith, thus imitating the early Christians who lit candles at the tombs of the martyrs. Five, to symbolize our good deeds according to the words of the Lord, let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father in heaven. Six, to obtain forgiveness for the sins of those who light the candle and for whom it is lit. That is why in many churches in various regions there are separate manually there are separate manually where where candles are lit for the living and for the dead. Okay, fair enough. So, I gotta find a place where these saint things are chilling. They're usually... Oh. Aha! Okay. So, that's Virgin Mary. That's... I actually don't know who that is. Might be Gabriel, for all I know. That's Jesus. Uh, okay. Everyone's starting to look the same here. I'm a little confused. Can we not? Please? Holy Bible. I can't do anything with this? What's over here? Nothing. Okay. Yeah, I'm used to the saints being on the side of the church. Oh, look at that. Here we are. There's no candle. Okay, we gotta find one. Alright. Where's the candle? Oh, just the burning upside down cross? Jesus Christ. Yeah, I guess so. That's a good one, Jug. I'll take that. Right, look underneath these two. Oh, that's it. Okay, let's check the other side. Excuse me. Pardon me. I know I'm so I'm so rude. Oh yeah. All of this. Yes. Ah. I remember when my brother used to come to church, he would always give some coins to the collection box. What did I just unlock, it said? Did I unlock the actual box? But that's all I need to do, right? Ah. Uh, found it. That's what I was looking for. The GD candle. Dun, dun, dun. What the hell was all that about? Alright. Well, this door going to open for me now? Oh, check it out. Yo, what up? Do I get to hold you? Uh... Alright, so zoom in, zoom out. Right click, I drop it. Oh, fuck. Right click, I pull it back. Uh oh No, I didn't want to do that. Uh... Yeah, it's gotta be... It's gotta be upright. How do I... There we go. This is a much better lighter, I will say. Um, guys, it uh, it went through the door. Hello. That name is written this on the holy place. That's the name of the traitor. You broke it. I did. It uh, it went through the door. I. I'm so sorry. Oh no. What was I supposed to do with that? Every time I approach this little thing, although the other, I went to the other side too. Whistles at me. It. Oh no. Was I supposed to use that somewhere? 
That's not even a door anymore. Hey, can any of you help me? I'm due to the congregation. I'm pretty sure I just screwed up. I got the collection plate right. I brought, I lit the candle and then they gave me the crucifix and it somehow phased through the door. Any of you help me? <laughs> Hello? I'll blow out your candles. Maybe I have to do that, actually. Uh, maybe the saints on the side, too. Watch, I'm gonna get like halfway through the light and then bang, I'm gonna get jump scared. I won't even see it coming. You grab it back through the door? Um, I guess I'll try that next. Might as well finish what I started here. But I won't extinguish that candle. Plus, I don't think they're gonna let me anyways. Yeah, I know they don't. I can't. Okay. Sick. Nothing happened. Oh, I also forgot these two. Oops. Uno. Dos. Legit nothing happened. Okay. So it gives me the symbol here as if it's there. I think I royally fucked myself here. <laughs> uh, this is not good. I don't know why I couldn't go through there either. I thought I did everything I needed to. What does it say? In the darkness of existence where shadows like despair reigns, the cross emerges as the ultimate weapon of a Christian. Its power strikes fear into the hearts of demons, shattering their malevolent grip on the soul. Through its sacred embrace, lost spirits navigate their path towards redemption, guided by the flickering light of hope. Oh, fuck. I was supposed to go the other direction with it and bring the crucifix out to the people in the congregation. Within its solemn presence, the cross becomes a beacon, piercing the veil of darkness, illuminating the way to salvation. <laughs> How did I manage it? Oh, real simple. I was holding it, and I walked forward to the door to try to open it, and it went through the door, and I didn't. And the door is locked, and I'm pretty sure I need to use that on all of the people out here. And it, like, it <laughs> see like, the symbols there to pick it up. <laughs> can I load game? Yeah, let's see if I can load the game. Uh, 42? Nine minutes ago? That's the best we're gonna get. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. Alright, it's actually where we left off, essentially, so... That's fine. I know what I'm doing now. Yep. I was ready for you this time. I'm assuming I have to, like, look at it. Okay, good. Okay. Now I'll run back here. Uh... Over to the left in the back. Oh, I'll make sure I pick up all of these along the way. Yep. It's good. Oh, oh, the candle, candle. And I think there was another next one. Yeah. Sick. Okay. Got it. Awesome. Now the crucifix will be here waiting for me. There it is. We pick it up. This thing falls. No worries. I don't go that way. And instead... I bring you the lights, my friends. The lights. <sighs> the lights. <laughs> I think this is working. You need that. Yeah, in the collection box, we didn't do that. Yes. <laughs> May the power of Christ compel you. The power of Christ compels you. The power of Christ compels you. 
What in the hell just happened? Why am I here? What have I done, my god? How do I let my brother die helplessly? That looks painful. Eh. Just mentioned it in their Discord. Thank you, Chuck. No problem. I call those Jesus poppers. <laughs> okay, I'm back here. Um, I'd like to hold onto that crucifix if you guys don't mind. I guess I'll try the door. Thank goodness. Am I in hell? He's asking at this point if he's in hell. At this very point. And appreciate you, Twy, for sharing the news. I'm sure they got a kick out of that. <laughs> <laughs> See, like, sometimes the camera just, like, resets itself somewhere, and I'm like, what's going on? And I turn and look, and I either miss it, or it's right in my face. The Christ's message of love and unity aimed to bring people together for a better world. However, even Jesus experienced betrayal from one of his disciples, Judas, calling the need to be cautious about who we trust. Well, I'm dead, so I don't really care who I trust now, do I? Yo, we got some, some coke up in there? What is all that? It's weird that they weren't lit. Two doors. I'm assuming it's supposed to be blood. Nope, there's four doors. Okay. I guess we'll start from back here. Nope. Aha! Alright, there's one that's open. That one also opens. That one updated. Life, relentless ticking clock, condemns us to count the seconds, minutes, and hours. Relentlessly propelling us forward. Lost in this perpetual march, we become slaves to the ceaseless rhythm, oblivious to the present moment. We dwell within the confines of a magnifying glass, our vision distorted, fixated solely on the burdensome trials that consume us. Time slips away, slipping through our fingers like sand. While we remain indifferent, apathetic to its fleeting nature, in our desperate quest to keep pace, we forsake the precious fragments of beauty scattered along our path, neglecting the ethereal treasures that exist beyond the confines of our meticulous calculations. This motherfucker's spitting. Alright, I'll check out the clock since they updated it here. I think the, the whole book was like, hey, this is important. The other door didn't do that. Alright, we got some light in here now. Ooh. Hello? Hello? Thank you. Light up the candles. Ooh, more. <coughs> Fucking. <sighs> right as I clicked on it, too. Not even a second of delay. <laughs> I got the key. Now. Ah. Fuck that. I'm doing the other room first. Is right, this one open or not? No, it doesn't. <sighs> oh my god. Juggy Jugs, baby! How are we doing this fine Monday? Yo, Ali, I'm doing well. Um, I think I just shit myself, though. <laughs> What's ready for that? How are you doing? I know you were, uh, I know you were streaming earlier. I had a little lurk up for you, but I wasn't really paying attention. <laughs> Hope all is well with you. Uh, the Last Supper room. Hi, Mila. Yes, that scared both of us, I think. I'm missing a fucking candle. Why are you giving me kisses? What do you want? You want to go to bed? You want to go Betty Buzz? You want to go to Mama? She's staring at me. 
Doing great, played some mortuary assistant, trying to get the new ending, still haven't though. How's Devil's Face? Uh, it's, it's a trip. <laughs> it's been something so far, that's for sure. I'm enjoying it though. Oops. Lighter fluid, it ran out. Ah, uh, there it is. Not. Do I not pick up any of these? Like, shit. Oh, I gotta go back and find it. And guess where the other candle is? In this back hallway that's gonna scare the shit out of me. Oh, so what kids is in bed? <laughs> Fancy seeing you here? <laughs> Practicing and fight forever. We definitely need to play together soon. Yeah, anytime. Doesn't even need to be on stream. You hit me up. We'll bash each other's heads in with guitars. Just like Double J would want us to. Mila. I don't like that whistle. Oh, it's a black candle. Lovely. Let me read the note first. Page four. You are where you deserve to be. Your demons have no name. You hear footsteps, but you have no body. You don't live, but you die. The darkness sees you. Consequences, death and life. Jesus. And Jeff Jarrett, we trust. Bash you with a pizza. I'm going to ollie on you. <laughs> uh, we got a black candle. That's totally what we need right now. Jeez. Black candle right in the middle of the Last Supper. That's totally what we need to be doing. Not a regular, you know, red candle that matches the rest of the room. Or like one of the big tall white ones with all the scripture written on the side of it. No, 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 no. We need a nice... Fucking... <laughs> I'm not gonna go there. <laughs> Rum. <laughs> Rum. Oh, fuck. Bestowed love, only to encounter betrayal. I'm getting dizzy. <laughs> Twy. Make sure aversions blow out that black candle. Don't want any Sanders and sisters to appear. For real. Grand life, only to encounter death. This is the real Jesus. <laughs> I surrendered my very being, and in return, I was met with excruciating agony. Cease to bestow your care upon those who are unworthy of even a sliver of your regard. Why am I so close to him? Okay. So, that was fun. Let's go check the other door now that wasn't opening, because we still had things to do. Like, uh, talk to whatever the fuck that was. Enhance. Yeah, I love that room. Oh, fuck. Just run. Who's doing that? Of course. Good evening. Long time no I know how to use it. <gasps> the fuck? Just keep going. Why'd you stop? <gasps> oh shit. I'm on the website actually. It ran like crap on your stream, I remember. Eternal damnation is feared by many, but it may stem from our fear of the unknown. Instead of fixating on this fear, it's more productive to live a fulfilling life. Love and respect yourself and understand yourself deeply. Appreciate life's beauty and accept our mortality. True fulfillment comes from embracing the present and cherishing meaningful relationships and experiences. By knowing ourselves, we can navigate challenges with grace and face death peacefully. And a bit of a hard time like game with it, I have mentioned it. Yeah. I remember you saying that too when you put because I remember I, I jumped in at some point when you started playing this. 
I ain't gonna look at those people. I don't need to. I'm out. The story of Cain and Abel represents the conflict between human selfishness and God's will, with Cain's jealousy and egoism leading to the tragic outcome of Abel's death. It serves as a warning to be mindful of our choices and actions and to strive for righteousness. Oh look, this we get to watch our brother burn to death in a fucking car again. This is hell. If you weren't 100% on it yet, it's definitely hell. <laughs> Hello? The, uh, the game froze? Oh, no, we're good. I, I think. I'm not, I'm not too certain. I, uh, I'm going to click out of the game really quick and click back in. Uh, <laughs> hello? This is intentional? Oh, okay. Is something going to come walk running towards me in a second here and that's why I can't move? I can't move. No. Maybe the, I'm going to even unplug my, uh, my foot pedal. Because I know that's caused issues before in the past. I really can't do anything. I clicked out of the window. I'm clicking back in. Let me make sure I can type something here. And good. Here you should be able to move here. The long pause is intentional. Okay. It's actually by voice control jug. Okay. Move forward. Oh, excuse me. Jug says move forward. <laughs> Okay. Um. No, Knox. What are we gonna do here? I don't know when the last time the game saved, but I think I need to Alt F4 out of this because really none of, none of my keys are working right now. Yeah, I can't do a thing. Not even the mouse is registering. Alt F4 it is. Alright, no worries. Let's see if we can, uh, get back into it. Hit F. Resume game. Oh no. I'll try playing this version again to see if I can get things to do this too. She taught me to yodel 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 Glowy. <sighs> Let's try again. Think. Health is full. Okay, thanks. All right, get ready for the jump scare. Come on, come on, Jug. You got it. You got it. You got it. <laughs> ah! And it's supposed to do that, and then... Ah, oh, here we go. Ooh, it's super sketch balls right now, though, for me. Like, it's, it's super framey. In the Book of Demons, the Forest of Sins is described as a pivotal stage in the journey of the soul, serving as the gateway to the deepest realms of hell. Anubis 3236 and 6889. What is wrong with you? Alright, um, so my apologies if anything gets kind of framey on your end. I'm not seeing any dropped frames, but it, what you're seeing is what I'm seeing. It's very close. Hello? Seven Deadly Sins. Oh, word, what's in the box? Oh, great. Back here. No lighter. Not again. Oh my god. This is what we call uh, purgatory. Oh, 
the door opens for me. I'm gonna get the book on this thing. Like one of the Paltrows in this game? Or maybe a Jack. <laughs> yeah, like game might be rough performance wise, just heads up. Thank you. Appreciate that. There's no is no VHS. Okay. Check the drawers for anything. Oh no 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 no. What's that? Oh my lighter. Sick. Let us travel. It's definitely a nightmare. No, dude, we're dead. The Book of Demons has been updated. Flames engulf the surroundings, casting eerie shadows on twisted and contorted figures. The air is thick with anguish, and haunting screams echo through the infernal abyss. Each corner represents a specific deadly sin, manifesting in grotesque and agonizing forms. Sick. Also, I'm mad they took all of my lighter fluid away. Oh, for fuck. Sakes, dude. Eyes are bulging, turning bloody, rolling back in the skull now. Screamy. The body just twitches at me. <laughs> God damn it. Yo, is this like insidious or what? All these red doors? So bad. Correct. <gasps> fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> what the f Hello? No lighter? I just had one in my f goddamn hand. What? My bro. Like what you <laughs> did with the place. Oh, yeah. It's a perturbator video. <laughs> Seven angels appear before me, but they are not white, like the ignorance of the soul, and they do not have white wings. They hang from their bonds, each of them carrying a mortal sin as a reminder of the living. Anubis 2217. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yo, G Rope, welcome in, my friend. How are you doing this evening? I hope you are well. I'm assuming you're playing Diablo. Uh, how's it running? So far, it's been good. The only thing was the weird. Freeze up, Hell's honestly. Thing. Ten and a half hour stream? Bro, good for you. Had a rough time in that room and mentioned did. I think they might have updated it. Oh, that's good. You'll love to see it. Holy oh, yeah. shit! I forgot ropes. Dude, this is a long clip. Wow. You did quite the battle there. Jesus. <laughs> I can't... Whoa, what the hell? We gotta really stop doing shit like that. The Diablo Fortnite and Madden. Why well, you did everything, huh? Lord. Hello? that light hello look at this dude sitting there arrogance oh yeah fuck it so yeah longest demo ever I agree but it's got everything here alright what's this one envy Oh, yeah. I wish I had what he's having. Yes, correct, Why? This will be a picture of me down in a fucking pizza for sloth. Wrath, yep. Beating the tar out of each other.
You think this is full of game? Well, it says beta, so I don't know. Laziness. That's also jug. <laughs> Greed. Yep, all that money. Two gold doubloons. Sloth. Oh, gluttony. Yeah, yeah, that's what I meant. I said sloth earlier. <laughs> Please be a pile of dicks for lust. Oh my god. It just, oh yeah, there it is. I think there's some boinking down there. Stigma. Time to get holy up in here, if you know what I mean. <laughs> oh, we have an update. The stigmata in Christianity refer to the physical wounds or markings that appear on individuals resembling the wounds of Jesus Christ during his crucifixion. I still don't have my goddamn lighter back. Hello? All my holes are filled with the light of the Lord. <laughs> yeah. Why do they do that? <gasps> Alright, one more? Nothing on that one. <gasps> Bro. I'll look at the pictures then. Painting from a Greek island. Painting from a Greek coastland. Um, the painting from the Par Parthenon of Athens is a favorite of mine and my brothers, as we both love Greece. Our I was hoping it would do it again. I've been there before. A very nice place. There we go. A bathroom? We actually have one? <laughs> fucking hell, dude. Was that fucking necessary? <gasps> Whoa! Why do they look in the mirror? <laughs> Cough up nails? Yeah, I think so. Look again. No? Oh, thank god it flushes. I was so worried. <laughs> I'm not too sure what that room was for, other than being a dipshit. Where the fuck am I? It keeps spinning me around. That's so creepy. Nothing. 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 Alright, I guess we'll just try the last door. Burb five ads. Ugh. People may often bring us pain, but it's important not to let that pain turn into anger. Instead, let it become a valuable lesson. In your toughest moments, you must learn to rely on your own strength. Take inspiration for the forgiveness of Christ towards those who crucified him. You're on private property. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> In a similar way, express gratitude towards those who have caused you pain as they have taught you valuable lessons along the way. Awareness. No later again. Back in this room. 
We're gonna lurk wanna go through my clips and get rid of dumb ones. <laughs> Alright, man. Appreciate you. We'll be here if you want to come back and hang after. But good luck. No oh, on chatterbait tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I won't go in the fucking kitchen then, my god. What the hell is wrong with that guy? I would have made him a sandwich. Ooh. What is going on? Uh, oh yeah. That's not a reflection, that's legit roof is twice as high and everything's upside down up there. Yuzo Tochime Dona That one's locked now. This is me. How is this happening? Bro, what if I sit on the couch? Look straight up. Nothing. Huh. Missed opportunity. Can you hold, please? I'm trying to find my lighter. Wherever it may be. I can't see it. Turn up settings, then look up. What do you mean, turn up settings? Yo, 80, what's up? Oh, 80, sorry. <laughs> How are you? Like, you want me to... To Epic? Also, nothing's shown, but there's a trigger warning coming up. Oh, I appreciate it. Yeah, I don't see anything special up there. I guess I'll keep it on Epic if everything's working well. No drop frames yet. <laughs> So my, so my sister gave me half her pizza so she wouldn't have leftovers. This pizza sucks ass and I'm waiting for her to go to bed so I could just reheat some leftovers. Did you like, hear about the guy who dipped his balls in glitter? Pretty nuts. God damn it. Like, holy shit, this pizza isn't horrible. It just isn't good, which is somehow fucking worse. I've never had bad pizza before. I've had pizza that's not fantastic, but I've never had bad pizza. That's, that's absurd. ID, how are you today? This can't all be true. Am I on the ceiling now? <laughs> hey. Hey, look up. This is something else. Jesus. The static shit, please. Oh, boy. <gasps> oh, they're gonna make us watch us do this, huh? Because this is how we died. We, uh, we... Our character took their own life after watching their brother died. And Satan's like, hey, do it, do it. Yep. Awful. Finished my first clone hero chart today. Oh, you got it done. Nice. Look up and walk. Yeah. It's like one of those ones Walmart made, and then you heat it up. Not like any brand, but you buy it near the deli. It's chicken Alfredo. I don't know if I'd get the chicken Alfredo for that particular type of pizza, but... I mean, you also didn't get it. <laughs> it, was, it was your sister who got it, and you're getting the leftovers from it. Oh, it's a save game. Nope. Hey! A bedroom! Uh oh, <laughs> that's not good. You're gonna silent hell me like that? Ow. That's awfully nice of you. I don't know how- I don't know about the devil's face, but you are cute. Oh, thank you, Heavy. <laughs> I want to mention I said hi when stream started and you haven't said hi back. Oh my word. 
Twy, I can't believe you would do such a thing. But I did, I'm so sorry. <laughs> what do you call a herd of cows masturbating? Beef stroganoff. Oh my fucking word. Which, what is happening? Do I have a fire extinguisher? Where do I fucking go? 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 I kept doing laps and Jesus, what the fuck? Do three things at the moment? <laughs> We really want Hamburger Helper. We don't have any, but it sounds really good. Yeah, I grew up on Hamburger Helper, man. That shit. And, um... Uh... Mac and cheese. Hot dogs. You know, brown bread from a can. That's what's up. Hi, Heavy. <laughs> Do I really help my hamburger most nights? Oh, my God. Pastrami is good. <laughs> Fuck. The redemption question mark? Hello, Knox. What is this place? Yeah, no lighter again. Oh boy. I shouldn't be here. Two different paths. And it won't. Does it say what's on either end? Oh, what the fuck? I want that heavy hand to see. What should you do in the game? Just explore? Yeah, this is like a walking simulator. Um, I'm gonna take the left hand path because reasons. <laughs> Oh, they both converge back in the middle anyways. Oh, hey, what's up, dude? Yo, we gotta talk. <laughs> or not. Uh... Alright, so you got a bit of an army behind me. That's, that's something. I really like that 75 degrees. <laughs> Try and keep it on an angle you really like. Okay. Uh, hey there. So, um... Jonathan, my servant. After what you have done to your brother, do you dare to ask for a second chance? No, my master, deserve, I don't deserve a second chance. Yes, I don't think it's my fault for what happened. I mean, you guys got into a car accident. He got stuck in there. Like, it wasn't like we did it on purpose, right? Do you seek to purify your soul? Have you truly punished yourself enough? No, my lord, I didn't punish myself enough. I believe that my punishment is sufficient. Sure. You're too fucking bad. Then you'll have the chance you want. Sounds good. <laughs> Ow. All right, I'm not going to approach you because I feel like that would be a bad idea. Wait, what? Am I in a Led Zeppelin song right now? <laughs> Punish me, daddy. Oh, God. Is this Super Mario 64? What the hell was that? Still no lighter in my equipment, so I have no idea where I'm going. I just got an achievement unlocked for hubris. The devil lies. Yep. Yo, Polish. What is up, my dude? Hope you're doing well this evening. What did that say? I couldn't even see it on the wall. It was too late. Ooh. 
Baby, do you know what that's worth? Oops. Heaven is a place on earth they say in heaven, love comes first we'll make heaven a place on earth you. Heaven is a place on earth. Thank you. <laughs> uh, am I in a hospital room? I turned the TV on, I think, but I can't turn it off. <laughs> Get heads. You said I was gonna get a chance. What the fuck, bro? Don't bullshit me. That clock is ticking so loud in my fucking ear. No, that's a Dettie's? Not really, but chilling with you is making things better. Oh, uh, well, sorry to hear you're not having a good one, man. But uh, I'm glad to hear you. I'm, I'm helping. So I appreciate that. I feel, I feel good that that is the case. Satan is Lord of Lies, yo. So we're back in this hallway again with my Lord, my uh, my boy JC. Oh, Fungu. Hey. Hi. Uh. So uh. I think I have to walk at you. And do not fear those who kill the body but cannot kill the soul. Rather fear him who can destroy both soul and body in hell. Matthew 10, 28. He just bitch slapped you. Oh yeah, he did. Life is short and often unpredictable. We all make mistakes, but at the end of the day, you have to admit them in order to move forward with your life with calmness and a clear conscience. The creator. Sa Savez? That's how you pronounce that. Yep. So all of that, there was no choice. Which, obviously, I kind of figured. I'm like, I'm already dead. I'm in hell. Why would they give me a choice to leave? That was good. A uh, hiccup here and there in terms of like some stuff, but overall, pretty decent. And I did things as uh, hasteful as possible. Still trigger warnings in there, but it, they handled it to the best that they could without being, you know. Did you know I can cut down trees just by looking at them? I swear it's true. I saw it with my own eyes. <sighs> that is awful. <laughs> okay. Anyways. That was the devil's face. <laughs> Bahaha applause. No, do not. <laughs> Gonna update my title really quick and all that. Oh, give me one second. You wanna go? Okay.
Okay. Not too bad for their first game. A little too many glitch jump scares, though. Yeah, it was more than peppered in. Uh, but yeah, sorry about that. Mila got up and was like, I want to go. And I'm like, okay. And I had to corral her and then tatered. Was out and about. Oh, so they, yeah, it's their website? Okay. Oh, so that's Savez. Oh, yeah, so that's their, that's the family name then. We love making games. Awesome. Well, it was good. I did enjoy it. And for, for like, like what Scaredy says, for a first game, a good job. Okay. Um, I need to finish updating my thing about Bob here. Hmm. What the hell? It didn't, uh, OBS is being weird again. Oh, there we go. Okay. So we're going to play Amanda the Adventurer. I don't know much about this. I just know it's supposed to be like Dorothy Explorer ripoff, but it's a horror game. Let's get all this stuff going. Okay, should be good. If you would like to follow me on over, let's go. I agree. I enjoyed it. Just Endgame had some performance issues when I played. Looks like it might have gotten fixed in the recent update. Yeah, which is, I mean, that's great that they they want to go and fix stuff too. All right. Volume English subtitles. Yellow. Uh, we'll keep it yellow. That's their default. So it's fine. Enable subtitles on. Okay. Graphics. Yep. 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 Okay. Input. Nope. Okay. Remap controls. Uh, WASD. Pause, escape, crouches, left control. Let's change that to C. All right. Let's do this. Yellow is a happy color. This is true. You said you did the Muppet Horror game. Did you stream it? Uh, I played the demo of it. It comes, the full game comes out next month. Um, and the game that Meg is referencing is My Friendly Neighborhood. We did play that demo. It was fucking creepy. And also kind of funny. Is this game about when the Land of Doors ancestors got colonized? Oh, Jesus Christ, Satan. <laughs> Dear Riley, if you're reading this, it means you won't see me again unless it's in the next life. I wish I could have told you everything. I don't know how much time I have, and there is still so much I have to do before I'm gone. This letter serves two purposes. To say goodbye and to bequeath to you my house in Kensdale. This next part may be a mistake, and God forgive me if it is. When you settle in there, something in the attic I need to pass on to you. Look for a tape, but know that once you watch it, there's no turning back. Stay safe, my dear. With you always, on Kate. Well... If it's so fucking dangerous, why would you pass that on? Thanks, Aunt Kate. This game uses auto-save features. Not quite to turn off the power. Okay, perfect. Oh. We're in the attic already. Mousetrap. The iner There's like inertia in this game. I think I'm playing Tarkov almost. Takes a minute to like get started up and moving. Ooh. Alright. Gotta find a safe. Oh, fuck, they're gonna make you watch Caillou. <laughs> God, I fucking hope not. That'd be the horror game I never wanted. This is a puzzle too, isn't it? Yep. This has also got to be a puzzle. My goodness. 
Oh, God, he was the fucking worst ever. My youngest liked that show. Oof. My condolences. Okay. Oh my god, something else I can unlock. There's so much stuff up here. <laughs> this attic rules. What's this? I got a nice peach. Did I just throw it? Oh, I did. Do I bring the peach somewhere? There, looks good. Don't be a stranger, I'm your neighbor. Okay. Building is still there to risk you to investigate. When did it change? Square behavioral complaints. Make appointment to review cold cases disappearances. What the fuck? Hi, I'm Kate. Thank you so much for the roller skates. Dad and I went skating at the lake yesterday. He fell down, but don't tell him I told you that. Came to see you at summer vacation. Love, Riley. Oh, we liked our Aunt Kate. You got a nice PJ. <laughs> What's up, Saz? Welcome in, friend. Hope you're doing well. Energy transfer. Would see sigils. TR investigating potential for dynakinite. Oh, God. It's a mouthful. Howdy, pal. How's the game going? We just started this one. Oh, God. Uh, we played the Devil's Face earlier, which was pretty good. It was uh, two brothers making a game together for the first time. Um, felt like I was playing like something like almost like, a, like an older Emeka game. Uh, very similar system and engine, uh, but it definitely had its own feel. Dear Miss Park, I know it's been a long time since you've seen me. I swear the library is sometimes the only place I felt safe. I must be grateful to you for that, for being someone I knew I could trust. I need that again to trust. Two years ago, my little brother Jordan disappeared. Just poof, gone. My parents were never the same, and now they're gone too. They just didn't get over the grief. It broke their hearts and eventually it killed them. The police figured someone snatched Jordan off the street. That some crazy guy lured him away. Freak occurrence, you know? A regular suburban tragedy, but I know there's something more to it. And I know you know it, too. I thought I was alone. Nobody believed me when I tried to bring it up. But I heard about the kind of research you do. The kind that normal people don't do. I don't know. Maybe it's just a rumor. But here I am. He used to watch that show, you know. It was really sweet at first. I remember that you even used to tell families with younger kids to watch it. It was, I don't know, wholesome, I guess. And then it just got weird. I'd find Jordan standing in front of the TV like he was in a trance. And it was like that little girl was talking to him. She said some really weird stuff. I know most of the people around here don't believe in the kind of work you do, not at the library, the other kind of work. They just don't want to face the truth that something really evil was here. Can we meet and talk? I don't want to write any more here. I feel like someone is watching me. Sincerely, Joanne Cook. Jesus. Oh, that's the Dear Ida on Kate. Yeah, we already read that. Right, I'll check that in a second. Oh, God, you're creepy as fucking hell. We got mushrooms growing out of this thing. Ay, ay, ay. This house is going to the shits. The drizzling shits. In the kitchen. In the kitchen, Meg. Man of the Adventurer. Hi, I'm Amanda. Hi. And I'm Wooly. Hey, Wooly. Today, we're going to make an apple pie. Okay. My favorite is peach pie. Oh, I found a peach earlier. What's your favorite kind of pie? Uh. Do I have to know the exact answer to this? Uh. Is it banana? Coconut? Like. <laughs> oh my god, yes. Mmm, that sounds delicious. <laughs> Thanks, Today, Knox. We're going to make an apple pie. First, we need to cut the apples. Okay. Hmm, do you know what we can use to cut the apples? She's my cherry pie cool drink of water. Such a sweet surprise tastes so good. Makes a grown man cry sweet cherry pie. <laughs> yeah? Yeah? Uh, we have to use a knife. Good job! We can use a sharp knife. Uh, I don't think we're supposed to do that by ourselves. It's always good to be brave when you're by yourself. Look, I'm a pirate. <laughs> that doesn't seem safe. 
Poor okay, Wooly. Let's cut the gap. That was hard. We have almost everything we need to make our pie. We just need some sugar. What's up, Jim? Welcome in, dude. Or the sink. How you feeling? How's how's it all going? The sugar is gonna be in uh up there. Wait, let's make a pie. Hmm, can you smell the apples and cinnamon? Yeah. Okay, it's time to bake a pie. First. Preheat the oven to 425. I don't think we should be using the oven by ourselves. We should always ask a parent to help. I'm not sure where they are right now. <laughs> We're on our own, Willie. Let's get back to First, it in our cut and run last night. Ah, uh, gross. Degrees. Hopefully it's better tonight, dude. Then put the apples into the pie tin. Now put it in the oven and bake it for 40 minutes. Two days ready. left. Holy I shit. Can't wait to eat it. 425. Wooly, yeah, so close. Bye, Wooly. That seemed like a pretty decent episode. She just uh, needs to chill out with being such a meanie to Wooly. Wooly brings up good points. Am I supposed to go make an apple pie now? Is that what this is? Like, I don't have any more tapes. Here, Wooly. What is that for? Huh. Oh, hey. Forty minutes at four twenty-five. And All right, we're going to get the apples. I heard that. Like someone just fucking farted over here. <sighs> Apple pie is okay, but... He can't pass it. Oh, scary. You you know the way to my heart. Oh my goodness. Oh, that makes sense. Alright, next episode. Hi friends. I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. CBF. What do you like best about your neighborhood? I like that. That's great. Oh, I didn't answer. I like that there are so why many is, why is why is there a dead stent like a dead person stencil in the sidewalk? Special to my friend. First, honey I whiskey need to pecan pie. Oh. To buy them a card. Took a minute for this game. Do you know uh -huh. where the store is? Hold on. Can we just time off for a second? There. That's a, like a chalk drawing of a fucking murder victim. The fuck? <laughs> that does sound really good, Knox. CBF might be important. Yeah, I was saying the same thing. CBF. So the fa my favorite part of this whole place? 24-7 um, corner store? Hell yeah, I gotta get my booze. Good job! Let's go to the store! Let's pick out a card. My friend helped me when New I was lab sad. Only one thousand five hundred dollars and twenty-five cents. Send them. A sad card. So, uh, happy birthday. Yeah, this one. Do you think that's what they need? All right, they'll be positive. Great! I found the perfect card. Time for the next Hope everyone's well tonight. Uh, I'm doing pretty friend good, do Jim. Nice thank you for asking me. Why is it closed? I want to get my friend a special treat. Can I have a special treat? I want to get my friend a special treat. <laughs> Where can I buy a treat for my friend? She completely just ignored Wooly. <laughs> God. Good job. Let's go get that treat. Mmm, everything smells so good. Hell yeah. 
I want to buy my friend some buy my friend some cookies. What the fuck was Can that? Can you show me where the cookies are? Right here. Those look so tasty. We just have one more stop in the neighborhood. The package is ready for my friend. They live pretty far from Little bum, because the boy so I was already to closed the time it. I got well, out of work, so I have to wait for Wednesday to go. Most oh, that sucks. We probably can't send that now. I have to send this to my friend. It's time to go to the post office. Let's send this package to my friend. Their name is... Wait. I don't remember. Can you help me? We can come back tomorrow. You don't have to send that now. No, I have to send this to my friend. Help me. Who does the package need to go to? Uh, let's see. Four letters. Oh, has to go to Knox. No, that's not my friend's name. It's apparently not Knox. Um, Alan? You have to know their name. Uh, I don't know their name, and I'm sorry. Uh, oh, Chug. Great work! Now we can send this to my friend. I typed Chug, and it typed on his cat. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Okay. Where'd the other tape go that was there? Oh, look where we are. Uh... How do I know what to play here? Um... In your neighborhood. I'm not gonna watch it again. Oh, CBF! Ah, yes, yes, yes. Thank you, Satan. Beethoven in training. My man, thank you. I even made note of it, too, and I forgot. Oh, it's you. Whatever you do, hey. don't... <laughs> oh no! Wooly had an accident! An accident is when something bad happens, but it's not anybody's fault. Accidents can happen in your house, at school, at the playground, and you can get hurt almost everywhere. At 3.45 this afternoon, we were playing and Wooly tripped and fell. I, I didn't try. Where on Wooly does it look like he got hurt? <laughs> knee. That's right. Wooly hurt his knee. Who can help when you 345, are 3.45, yeah. This would be the alarm clock. Uh, doctor. I don't Oops. think they can help. I misspelt it. Calm down. Let's take Wooly to the hospital to see a doctor. Hmm, which room should we go into to find the right doctor to help Wooly? I uh, ran out of water, so I'm just going to crack a beer, Brian, but thank you. All right. Also, remember, uh, 620 is also up there, too. So he needs help with his knee. Uh, dentist. Cardiologist. So I guess this would be the right one. Come on. Let's get Wooly fixed up. I don't up. think we need to board the doors up. Here's like 6% really water, so it's close enough. It's like 90% water, actually. Right Let's see how we can help Wooly. Which tool can we use to check Wooly's injury? The heart monitor, the x-ray machine, or the scale? The scale, fat fuck. No, I'm kidding. That's right. Now we can look or at Wooly's Or 2250. Mm. Uh, that's where it ends? Now we can look at his bones. I like how it's 
2001 copyright. Alright, so that was fucking weird. Okay. So, she made sense at 345 first. This is going to take a while. Nice. Okay, it was 345. Is it going to stop? Oh, it's even 345 over there. Uh, yo, Diablos, what's up? We hanging in there. What am I doing with this thing? Oh. Well, this is already a 345. Maybe this one I could do the 620. See if that does something. Oops. That's what's chilling. Got my PC working in finally. Awesome. Love to hear it. How have I been? I'm good. Just, uh... Got it. Oh my god, so good. So those are spinning. That's spinning. Um... Yeah, uh... I've been pretty good. Really no complaints. Um, just doing what I gotta do with work and everything. TikTok, TikTok. Alright, so what's the... Hello? What is this that I just picked up? What? That doesn't work. What is this for? I'm kind of out of things to use here. <laughs> Let me put this over here. Yeah, this game's pretty good so far. I'm still a confused this one part. Catching up with Sam. Sam Colton wasn't going to be a father to a town icon. Last summer, it became clear that his public access series made of the adventure and its title character were something very special. For the self-professed struggling writer, it all started with his adopted daughter and a new outlook on life. You say caught up with Sam over a stack of the Sunflower Diner's famous strawberry banana pancakes. That sounds good. He shouted about the value of imagination, everyday adventures, and what the future may have in store for Amanda. Lacey. Sam, not a day goes by when my kiddos aren't talking about Amanda and her adventures. Did you even did you even dream that this little show would be a, a big hit? A uh, little show is right, isn't it? But I think there's something elegant in simplicity. We may not have the budget for a big production, but I truly believe there is a soul that transcends that. I'm holding by the way the town has embraced my something I really am. March 24th, 2000. Okay. So, what is it? Like, cool, I got these damn things spinning and going fucking crazy. Same with this one. What the fuck? Where'd the safe go? It's the cardboard box now. Maybe I can do CBF again?
Oh. Tried. Alright, the alarm clock, we could try 345, I assume. Oops. Oh, you fucker. What was the other one we said? It was 620. So none of those work here. So that's not... Oh, that's how long we've been playing for. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> uh, hmm. Anybody got any ideas? So far I haven't found anything that's super helpful. And the fact that the safe is fucking missing. What the hell was that? What the hell is that? What is that symbol? I can't fucking see it if I throw it down. What is that? Uh, oh! That's like, maybe a hand on the clock, and that's the big hand trying to be 12. Oh, no. Those are those symbols we saw somewhere else. I think they're... What is this? Oh, it was just upside down. I get it. Huh. Eat the box, nom nom. I mean, typically, yes. I'm, uh, not following what I'm supposed to be doing here. And, like, does this thing actually do anything, or...? Can I use it to set off the fucking trap? Nope. Oh! That worked. Maybe this is the 620 one as well? 620 is like this. That's not it either. Was there another one I was supposed to be using here? Like another time? Because this we did, that was 620. This one was 345. And we've been changing that one, so that doesn't really fucking matter. No time listed there. There's really no time on this at all. There's a date, but it's not helpful. 2250? So that's what, 10.50? On the clock in the doctor's office? Oh, thank you. I don't know how I missed that one.
Now that's 2250. So it's 1050. Shrug. <laughs> Fuck. Can you rewatch the video? Yeah, I believe so. It's probably our best bet, huh? Huh, again. Oh, it's you. Whatever you do, don't I can fast forward. That part of Wooly looks fine. Oh, right. That's right! Wooly hurt. Take yeah, it was 620 here. She said 345 during all of that. Come on, let's get Wooly fixed up. Amanda, 2250. Yeah, what the, the fuck? The oh. Right all right. So twenty-two fifty. It's probably for this. Uh. There we go. Five fifteen AM. Everything just stopped. Five fifteen. Five fifteen. Uh Okay. Well, I know what to set this now. Yeah, Satan, you nailed it, my dude. Aha! These little arrows, scratched arrows. What the hell? What does that say? Safe eight two six. Well, that doesn't help. Let me try this one first. Even though it's not really a safe, and it's also four, so it doesn't work. Yeah, safe eight two six. We'll remember that whenever it decides to, you know, come back and be a safe. What? Here we go. Hi, Ken. I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Wooly looks better. It's such a nice day for a picnic. BBs. What's your favorite food to eat at a picnic? Oh, I don't like that at all. I didn't ask Amanda, you. What's that smell? I've never smelled anything like that. Hmm, I don't know, Wooly. You're right. It's a bad smell. Did you bring a dead animal what with you? What do you think is making that bad smell? Amanda's asshole? Uh, I don't know what that is, but... Oh, it's a moldy sandwich. Can I just say <laughs> Amanda's ass? It's... I'm liking right. it, man. This is good. This sandwich is stinky because it's rotting. It's rotting. This tree stump is rotting too. Do you know why? Things rot when they are not alive anymore. Jesus fuck. Do you know what the opposite of alive is? This is aggressive. Uh Nox. <laughs> Look at the tree stump. If it's not alive, what is it? <laughs> Jug. I don't think we should be talking about this. <laughs> hey, hey. That's dead. right. The tree stump sleeping is, dead. is sleeping. <laughs> dead is the opposite of alive. Good job. Men can die if they don't get enough light or water, or if they get a disease. Let's go back to our nice picture. Uh, the first rule of drug club is you not talk about drug club. True, Frantic. How are you, my friend? Poor Mr. Fox. What the fuck? What do you think killed him? The gun, the knife, or the poisonous berries on this bush? I'm gonna go with the poisonous berries. Cause uh, 
It doesn't look like he's bleeding, but he definitely looks like he's dead and his tongue's hanging out. I don't think that was it. Can I click on you? No? Okay. Uh, we'll go with the knife then. No, it wasn't that. Look at his funny tongue. He's silly. What killed him? Wouldn't it be nice if he could tell us? Mr. Fox, what made you Good, until I saw this shit. This has a don't hug me, I'm scared vibe. I don't... What else am I clicking on here? Can't click on you. It was the ugly old bear trap. Mr. Fox what didn't the even know what got him until it was too late. Amanda, this has gone too far. I don't like this. We saw so many things today. A riding sandwich, a riding tree stump, and silly old riding Mr. Fox. Sandwich, tree stump, Mr. Fox. Sometimes I feel myself riding, but it feels far away. Amanda, nothing is rotten here. What do you think? Do you think that everything rots? Of course not, Amanda. I'm not asking you. <laughs> answer my question. You don't have to answer that. Uh, maybe. Why won't you answer my question? Uh, sure. That's what I was afraid of. Hello? Uh, who is it? What the fuck is that? Can't... Is that how the game ends? Let me do continue. Maybe that isn't supposed to happen and I'm supposed to survive. Oh, look. What is it? Red, orange, blue, beige, potato, lilac, yellow. Okay. Oh, it's a pause button. It's one ending. Ah, I did it? Yay, I died. Oh, I see. Now the pause button works. Okay, that's helpful. Potato. Nothing else in here, huh? That's it? That's just a little screw or something, it looks like. Yeah. Alright, cool. Grand. We'll bring it over here, I guess. And it's also missing two other things there. Oh! Holy shit. Oh! Oh, those are the symbols on the, uh, the potted plants. Interesting. And are you the, the buttons I have to press in accordance with that? It was great, by the way, tons of hidden shit to do. Yeah. Yeah, I've been liking it so far. Um, yeah, because these things here... It's like this has the H on it. The H is purple. Is there a purple button on here? Uh, yes, there is purple. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, seven, twelve. Are there twelve colors here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, you know what? Cause I bet your check mark and X don't count. So, I wonder what, do I just put them in, in this particular order and that's it? So 
So we'll do red, orange, blue. Red, orange, blue. Beige, potato, lilac. What the fuck? Uh, I don't really see beige here. Or potato. I, I guess you'd call this lilac or something. I don't know. There's something I'm missing. I don't think I'm looking at the right thing. Uh, this mess. All these messages are back to Wait, what's the certificate? Catherine Park for dedication achievement in the field of Children's Library Services, March 12, 1993. Alejandro Phillips signature. Okay. Hmm. You don't do anything. You just sit there menacingly. Oh, that's not a... That's not a good thing. Oh, yeah, that's pink. Okay, I get it. Do I just bring this... Uh, bring this over here somewhere for a minute? There. Oops. Whatever. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So there's one more. Four, seven, nine. So it says that there's ten colors. So oh, right here. Got it. Okay. Now, is there a place I can bring them? I also need that unlockable thing there. There's that peach again. Hmm. <laughs> you did that. Did that. I I feel like it has to be this, but it doesn't make any sense because it's missing the colors. Unless, of course, this is how to categorize these if i want to categorize them where am i gonna where am i putting them for that particular cut like the like is there a place i can bring it that's interesting Does anybody have any ideas? Release hints. Because I'm not too sure where I'm supposed to be bringing that shit. But I feel like it... Like, this, the only thing that makes sense is this dude right here. But it makes, like, half sense. <laughs> oh, that's in the kitchen. That's where we made the apple pie. So I don't, want, I don't need to do that one again. Huh. Ooh, excuse me. Want a hint? Yeah, I wouldn't mind a hint. Just to kind of keep things going. Colors and real butter are not linked. Okay. That helps. Kind of. So your aunt died? What the fuck? The joy of cooking sheep. Um, gib. Gib flocks. The. What the fuck? The untold story? What the shit? Some puzzle game right there. Inv Invisible Jan? Oh no, Inquisitive Jan discovers tax fraud. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, okay. So, 
how are we going to make you guys work? There's got to be a place with all of these colors that exist somewhere. And I drop that particular symbol into that particular area. I just pulled a mushroom out and think I could actually do that. You just uh, chill there in the water for a bit, alright? Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I thought that was a key up there. I was like, whoa, whoa, but it's not. So we know it's not you. Those are not all the colors, plus that's a whole different puzzle. Got that open. There's nothing else in here. Hmm. Oh, fair enough, pony boy. <laughs> That's not surprising in the slightest, now that I think about it. I typically have walkthroughs open for whatever reason. This is just like, it's kind of weird. Because I'm trying to just figure out where I would bring this stuff. Unless, of course, it's not every single one. There's just some colors that I have to transcribe. But even so... You have to use the pause button throughout the video. Oh, you know what? That's what I fucking forgot about. Thank you. So I have to go through the process and get back to that... Oh, well, I mean, well, I guess we'll start within the kitchen. Now that I have a pause button. That's obnoxious. Hi, I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Today, we're going to make an apple pie. My favorite is peach pie. What's your favorite kind of pie? Mmm, that sounds delicious. Today, we're going to make an apple pie. First, we need to cut the apples. Hmm, do you know what we can use to cut the apples? Yeah, I feel like this game required a lot of hand-holding, not very obvious with the clues on progression. I should have thought of the pause button. I just completely forgot about it. What we can use to cut apples? Penis. We can't use that. You want a bat? <laughs> Good job. We can use a sharp knife. Uh, oh, fuck. I just saw the pause. How do I go backwards? I just saw that. Behind her head, it had a pause button. Fuck. Uh, rewind. No, damn it. I don't think we're supposed to do that by ourselves. Go it's back. It's always good to be brave when you're by yourself. Look. I'm a pirate! Ha <laughs> That doesn't seem safe. Okay, Willie. Let's cut the gas That was hard. Oh, no, never mind. It's not there anymore. Now it's just the pie. What the fuck? Hard. We have almost everything we... Great! Let's make a pie! All right, let me do that one more time because I definitely started at the last second possible. Uh, apple. Mmm, that sounds delicious. Today we're going to make an apple pie. Ooh, I've returned to something new. This looks weird. But I judge your mm, camera's looking you crisp as hell lately, I must say. Thank you. Appreciate it. I haven't done anything to it. <laughs> All right, so knife. Good job. Stove's on fire. Oh, 
lighting what the lighting must be making a big difference because you look fab i haven't done anything with the lighting either but again thank you look at the knobs yeah fire it's time candy welcome in friend what the fuck why did that change this changed I hit pause and you can see this back here <laughs> what the fuck this I think I had to go touch that or look back at it to make this update because this was not the scene I just had let's see what happens <laughs> fuck Meat pie. Ingredients, 200 grams of potato, 200 grams of mushroom, 350 grams of meat. Preheat the oven to 525. In a pie tin mix, meat, potato, and mushroom. Bake for 50 minutes and enjoy. Okay. I could do that. So this is 525. For 50 minutes. This is heavily spoily because I want to play this too um yeah we're it's it's a lot of puzzle stuff i don't want you to leave though meat potato and mushroom there's one potato <laughs> Give me the moon. No. There it is. <laughs> Meat, potato, and mushroom. Well, I'm leaving. Wow. My heart. Well, have a good day, day and night. Come back, Candy. I miss you. That's just dirt. It might be potato one day. Laser bought it for me, so I want to stream it. Oh, that's nice. Dirt, not poop. And that's a peach. We've been through that. Still can't open that. No new notes over there. Oh, wait, yeah, dirt, mushroom. We knew the mushroom already existed. That's easy. Yeah, it definitely isn't clicking the right way. Okay. We got the mushroom. We need a meat meat and potato. That's cheese. Meat and potato. Apparently I don't understand what you're doing. I mean, that's like most days, though. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Meat and potato. Oh, I wonder if I could put the cheese on that if it does anything. Wow, Judge, you have to say I'm dumb like that. I didn't say you're dumb. Look at that. That capture. I got the meat. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> Time to find a potato. <laughs> you ever really understand the kind of a man Sicilian hot sauce? I mean, that's true. <laughs> Man, I just want one potato out of that. Damn it. We're gonna find a potato. Where, oh, where do we find a potato? Potato, 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 potato. Is it a couch potato like you? No?
Damn it. I've got the meat, he says. Calm down, Candy. Where do potatoes come from? I'm a potato, kind of. Yeah, potatoes come from the ground, and we know that this symbol here equals potato. But I don't know how to get the potato out of here. That's the problem. <laughs> A potato. Boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew. Damn it. I don't think there's just a random potato hanging around. Unless I gotta drop it right here. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. There we are. Now, will it let me put it in here? We got it. God, I'm good. What's the problem, Spud? <laughs> Stick him where? Oh my word! I'm gonna be careful of the pause button. Hi there, I'm Amanda. And I'm Lily. Amanda, maybe some of our friends can come back to the neighborhood. That's great. There's I more dead bodies so showing up around them. In my neighborhood. No, Today, they're all dead. I want to send something special to my friend. First, I need to go to the store to buy them a card. Do you know where the store is? Right over here, Ding Dong. Good job. Let's go to the store. Let's pick out a card. My pet. Something bad happened. What kind of card should I send them? Okay. Oh. This is on purpose. Uh, F-A-C-F. -F. No, wait. Isn't the spaces F-A-C-E? Every good boy deserves fudge. Something like that. Yeah, I think that's what it is. F A C A. F A C A. Every good boy does. Every good boy deserves D. E. Can someone write that down? Oh my God! It's facade. Thank you, Twy. Oh my god, you said Flash was to playing the recorder in grade four. <laughs> D candy. That's not the right card. I don't think we want this. I think Amanda is confused. <laughs> hmm. Thanks, Twy. Enjoy your shower. It's my birthday. Maybe we can help her out. Are you sure that's right? I don't it looks like it. I bet your friend is really going to love this card. My friend is... <laughs> P-E-N-I. <laughs> you should have read it down, so I did. My friend is having a birthday. I want to get my friend a special treat. Where can I buy a treat for my friend? Oh, I know. Let's get them some nice candy. You sure you want a mistake? You know where the candy store is? You can have a mistake if you want. Great! What? Why did you do that? What are the... Now I can't find the candy store. I don't know where to go. I didn't do that. Let's go to the... Don't do that! I didn't do anything. This one? I don't want to go there. Okay, here? I said I don't want to go in there! This one? No! Why is this happening? This one? No! Why can't I stop it? This isn't the candy store. There is nothing here that I want. Maybe you can take us someplace else? Burn disembowelment has to be one of my new favorite <laughs> handles. Yes. Uh, a special treat? You have the knife. 
I want to get my friend a special treat. All right, fine. I, where did it go? Amanda, did you take that? Well, let me get him some wieners. Let me out of here! Oh, Amanda, that's that's a nice birthday card. Do you want to give it to your friend now? It's bowel, not bowl. Will you address the card? Who should I send this to? <laughs> send it to Wooly. Oh, Wooly, it's your birthday. That was fucked. What are we doing over here? What is this? Where? 24 7. We tried to meet. We went. Candy, you took me. Oh, God. So that's just for here sound delicious though to be frank. Uh worthwhile trade-off. Hand you just sausage stuck to a ham. Huh. My bad sausage so <laughs> fingies and old lady eyes, you see. The person is mildly entertaining too sometimes. Wow. They called hams. Hams. What am I supposed to be doing here? So like So we went here to get the card, here to get candy, and then leave. And then I'm like, okay, we didn't really do that. We went and got a card, and then ended up getting meat, and we, we should have gone here. Where? We tried to. We went. You took me. I guess I'll just keep trying until I figure it out. Alright, this gotta be a better fucking uh clue here. I am not understanding that for a second. card I don't think we want this I think Amanda is con are you sure that's right I don't it looks like it I bet your friend is really going to love this card my friend is my friend I'm my waiting friend for a pause is having a too. birthday I want to get my friend a special treat where can I buy a treat for my friend? Oh, I know. Let's get them some nice candy. Do you know where the candy store is? They don't have anything we need. Look at the stores. Which one sells candy? Technically. Uh, does this help? <laughs> Great. Look, why did you do that? Now I can't find the candy. Maybe I have to pause it there. Does that help? Does that do anything different? Is Iron Amanda on an adventure to Jugs? Adventure to Dreamland. She as she was here earlier. Alright, maybe I have to find it. I have to hit pause when it's just the candy store. Candy store! This 
This isn't the candy store. There is. Where does this fucking knife go, Nothing by the way? Here that I want. Maybe you can take us someplace else? I want to get my friend a special treat. That's not funny. <laughs> Let me out of here! Oh, Amanda. That's... That's a nice birthday card. Do you want to give it to your friend now? Will you address the card? Who should I send this to? I don't think it's their birthday. Oh, it's time, baby! Yo, Wheeler! What's up, my friend? Welcome in. Oh, yeah, battle bits. Hi, I'm Steve-O, and this is the Pussy Blast Off. Hi, Riz. I'm waiting for a nice snipe. Or he's gonna die instantaneously. Double kill! <laughs> well done, Wheeler. Well done. Welcome in, friends. Hey, Fry. What's up, Black Metal? Welcome in. Hope you're all doing well. Um, I'm currently very confused at this particular point in the game that we're playing. Lots of creepy puzzles. Um, Amanda the Adventurer. Or The Adventures of Amanda? I don't remember. I don't remember the name of it. But uh, this is supposed to be to Wooly. Oh, Wooly, it's your We birthday. Zelda the bit and I debuted the new channel trail that will be up on YouTube tomorrow morning. Ooh. Look forward to checking that out. All right, so that's the end of the tape. It didn't really help me do much. And I'm not following this puzzle. Where we went tried to you took me hmm like I'm not this one I'm just not following that well like I only pick three things I'm like Just not. Because we get the card from the 24 7 store. And we tried to go to the candy store. We ended up at the meat store. Oh, fuck, that worked. Where, 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 okay. Uh, 24 candy steak. It's working. Uh, 24 seven candy meat. Guts. And scissors cut off the do What the fuck? And then this, that symbol looks like something. It's a cool looking H or something like that. But guts I can do over here. The code for the lock is guts. See the lock. I just feel like problems with this. Good job. Oh, yeah, yeah. I've, um. Oh, no, not this one. There's a different one. It's a toolbox. There we go. Sick. And the scissors to apparently cut the head off of this fucking doll. Okay. Listen here, fuckhead. 
dolls aren't supposed to be living things. You need to come out right now and just let this happen. <laughs> Where the fuck did it go? This is not good. One goddamn bit. Put this down here. You watch the video that cut off the doll's head? Yeah, maybe. Um, oh, also, what was that symbol they tossed at me? It was this one. Yellow. See, it looks like a, a 21 or like a cool looking 4. 21 or cool looking 4. Yellow. yellow. Do I just put the plant there? Is that what it wants? There it is. No. Alright, let's go put it under the water. Maybe it'll grow something that we need. Hell yeah, brother. Not no. All right. Do I put it where? No. Does it need more water? Ah. That's it. Put it again, try it just a case. Okay. Alright, so we got some nice flowers here. Oh, we can put them right here on the thing. Nope, it's gonna be stupid. Even though I just landed it. Okay. I don't know what that means. I thought I was doing the right thing. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> God damn it, Fry. Alright, something is very amiss here. Whatever, whatever happened there, it disappeared. It went like staticky and disappeared. I wonder if it's in the TV. Might be a good place for it, actually. Hi there. I'm Amanda. And I'm Lily. Amanda, maybe some of our friends can come back to the neighborhood? That's nope, they're great. dying. I like that there are so many friends in my neighborhood. Today, I want to send something special to my friend. First, I need to go to the store to buy them a card. Do you know where the store is? Yes, I do. It's over here. Good job. Let's go to the store. Let's pick out a card. My friend... Something bad happened. What kind of card should I send them? That's not the right card. Oh, wait a second. I forgot about the facade. You can do that over here. F A C A D E. Oh, hell yeah. It's, uh,. I don't think we want. Are you sure that's right? Great! Look! Don't do that! I don't want to go there! No! I want to get my friend a. Let me out of here! Oh, man. Oh, 
Willy. It I don't know if it's just that was that shade of orange. Fuck yeah. Alright, that's the end of that tape. Now we can put this one in. Let's see what this one is. Great with the pause. There's the birthday girl. Usually my mom holds my treat money. Well, come on, Lauren. We have a special surprise for you. Okay. Here's what I have. <laughs> Who's ready for ice cream and cake? She's busy with her best friend. Excuse you. Is that show on 24-7? It's like she didn't even hear me. And we need to talk about some new TV rules. <laughs> Good luck you know, with that. Let me, let me try. I, I want to want to capture the big surprise on video. <laughs> nice mustache. We got cake and ice cream. We got your favorite, mint chocolate chip. Come on, baby. We can watch Amanda another time. It's so much fun Lauren? to buy your own Everything okay? What the fuck? Lauren? Mm, Lauren? I love mint chocolate chip. What the fuck? <laughs> can we show you guys? Nice. And thank you, Meg, for the bits. Look so irritated. Not irritated, that was just something else. I'm curious what that the whole point of that tape was. Something about mint chocolate chip. Excuse me. I still don't know where the fuck that thing went. Why is the oven open? I didn't do that. Shit. Wait, this is back? Can I make it grow more? No, okay. Tape from the toolbox? Oh, shit! My man. What? What's a family? Oh, boy. This'll be interesting. Did he? he said ba because he is a sheep. Can you make a sound like a sheep? Bah. That's great. Thank you. You sound just like Wooly. <laughs> <laughs> wow, yeah. You sound just like me. I hit pause a little too late. At a petty Didn't zoo. tell me to hit pause there though. Are lots of here to pet and play with it's fun to spend time with animals they are very different from people <laughs> Fuck they <them. laughs> look different and they don't talk like people amanda i'm an animal and i animals don't talk silly look at these signs let's make sounds like the animals on the signs are you ready a goat says meh meh a chicken says, a pig says, like, Jesus fucking Christ. Fun. Animals make funny sounds. <laughs> I mean, it is kind of a dick. Oh, yeah, Do she you is. Have a family? Animals have families too. Let's go see one of the animal families. I want to see the chicken. Can you show me where the chickens are? Great! Let's go see those silly chickens! What a cute family! Having a family is nice. I see a mommy chicken and baby chickens, and I see... I see a daddy chicken. Look at the chickens! Do you know what the daddy is called? Cock. The daddy is called a rooster. The <laughs> pig says, please. The hen, and the babies <laughs> are chicks. Some mommies eat their babies. 
Yum, yum. <coughs> okay, let's go see some more animal families. Where should we go Cock. next? I think it's time to visit the sheep. <coughs> can you tell me where we can find the sheep? He's right here. <laughs> okay, let's go. Look at the nice sheep family. All the sheep are right where they belong. <laughs> Poor Wooly. Blizzard warning. Hi, little kitten. Where is your family? It looks like this kitten is all by herself. Just helping the sheep over the fence, officer. <laughs> <laughs> Fed up. She must be so scared. Uh, sad. Leave. There's nobody to love her. Kitten is alone. There is no one to help her. So you help Can her you then. Help the lonely kitten. Uh, yes. The fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Sheep are aliens? Yeah, maybe. The fuck that? Oh, hey, this finally came out. When that truth comes out. All your knees lies. Hmm. So something's ah. Uh, we have to pause it on the particular scene. So it's been. So whatever comes up first, which should be the storm. The game is calling you a sheep. Yeah, I'd say so. Hi, friends. I'm Amanda. And I'm... Great! Let's go see those silly chickens. What a cute fib. Having a family is nice. Wait, did I... Is this skipping the it? daddy is called a rooster. It okay, is fuck. I fucked up. Kitten is alone. All right, I gotta replay it and then not skip the beginning. Damn it all. We have to be patient. Bam, bam. I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Bah. <laughs> Wooly just made an animal sound. He said bah because he is a sheep. Can you make a sound like a sheep? That's great. You sound just like Wooly. <laughs> <laughs> wow, yeah. You sound just like me. Got it. All right, that one's next. At a petting zoo. There are lots of animals here to pet and play with. It's fun to spend time with animals. They are very different from people. They look different and they don't talk like people. Too creepy. Amanda, <laughs> I'm an animal and I- Animals don't talk, silly. Look at these signs. Let's make sounds like the animals on the signs. Are you ready? This game is fucked. Says, yeah, it is. Meh, meh. A chicken says. A pig says. Like. 
<laughs> Animals make funny sounds. Do you have a family? Animals have families too. Let's go see one of the animal families. I want to see the chickens. Can you show me where the chickens are? Great! Let's go see those silly chickens. The silly chickens. Having a family is nice. I see a mommy chicken and baby chickens. And I see... I see a daddy chicken. Look at the chickens! Do you know what the daddy Pick up for the called? third time today. Someone come scare me. <laughs> the daddy is called a rooster. The mommy is a hen. And the babies are chicks. Some mommies eat their babies. Yum, yum. Yum, yum. Okay, let's go see some more animal families. Where should we go next? I think it's time to visit the sheep. <laughs> can you tell me where we can find the sheep? Okay, let's go! Look at the nice sheep family. All the sheep are right where they belong. <laughs> the fuck is with the barn? <laughs> You're telling me. Alright, nailed it. Next one. I guess that's not a blizzard. We need a tornado warning. The other tape? Yeah, that's... I'm thinking there might be a possibility, but I don't remember it happening on this. Hi, little kitten. Where is your family? It looks like this kitten is all by herself. How do you think she feels? Alone. Kitten is alone. There is no one to help her. Yes, I'll help. Hmm. I remember there being a, a weather advisory thing on that tape. This is really strange. In that box it was in? No? Okay. I get it. You want me to pause? A tornado warning. Can't open that up yet. And I guess I'll try to go through the other tape. Won't hurt, I suppose. All right, we'll watch it again. See if there's anything different in here. Where's the birthday girl? Usually my mom holds my treat money. Well, I'm come on, Lauren, we have a special surprise for you. Okay. Here's what I had. <laughs> Who's ready for ice cream and cake? She's busy with her best friend. Ice cream and cake. It's like she didn't even hear me. And we need to talk about some new TV rules. <laughs> you know what? Hold on. Let me try. I, I wanna I wanna capture the big surprise on video. <laughs> Lauren, honey. We got cake and ice cream. We got your favorite, mint chocolate chip. Come on, baby. We can watch Amanda another time. It's so much fun Lauren? to buy your own shit. Everything okay? Oh. Lauren? Mm, Lauren? I love mint chocolate chip. <laughs> Yeah, nothing uh, there, unfortunately. Hmm.
Uh, I think I'm running out of ideas here. I am not certain I know what is next. I don't know how to get the recording of what seems to be a tornado. But you count what the fuck's going on outside, I guess, then that would work, but. Do you put the pause button on the back of the speaking spell? Uh, I don't think I could put the button there. I can't take it out. Let's see. <sighs> Use me. I mean, so far we're doing pretty good. Fuck. There's just something that's missing somewhere. Nothing new in here anywhere. Okay. What color was on that wardrobe lock? It looks like it is green. Green cube. What do you turn it apart with the cat? Do you pause there and create a tornado? Oh, you know, I didn't think of that. store sign potentially right where they belong oh shit i'm getting a call i'll be right back i wonder what happens if i open this what the hell room is this walk into it or anything? Like, what the fuck? Uh-oh. Oh, shit. It was a fucking trap. What? What? I don't... I don't even know what I just saw. Oh my god! That reality crumbles around me. Maybe my mind is playing tricks on me. I don't know. Well, when I'm in the lab, the second I'm sitting in my ruined home, Thurman, I'm clinging for my life in a dark place I don't recognize. Even the rooms look different. It's almost as if they're stuck between hell and here. I saw my dead brother. He's going to be my company now until my sanity leaves me. What Jesus. lab? I don't see any lab around here. <gasps> <gasps> Holy fuck. I'll do that tomorrow. I'm off work tomorrow, by the way. Uh, so that wow the timing 
Hello, Meg. <laughs> Good news. It's an easy SEV3 case. So I just had to send an email, said I would look into it. And that's it. Thank you. So that's the blizzard warning. That's not what we want. Oh, you were on call for... Oh, sorry. Thank you. Will you help the lonely kitten? I'm waiting. That didn't work. Fuck. It's too fast. I don't think that's right. Like, there's no sense of a tornado in that video. I'm not getting any. Same with the other one. There must be another tape somewhere that I haven't found yet. If I find the other tape... Gooch. Now, what the fuck is this robot for? We still haven't figured it out yet. You only do keyboard cat once every four minutes, yet you fail more than that. Wow. Maybe not, but was the thought. Remember she's saying accidents happened by no one's fault and went red, I think. Yeah, it's done that a few times. The thing is, is I can't look through those other older tapes because they're no longer here for me to grab. Can't do anything with that. Um... Any other symbols anywhere that I can use those plants for? And then this thing. I'm not too sure what to do with that. Wow. Yeah, the only number I could think of for that was 2417. Out, uh, out of curiosity, why 2417? And I'll try it. Oh, 24 7. Oh. Uh, worth a shot, I suppose. Nope. This is a good idea, Scaredy. I applaud you for that. How do we make a tornado? Like, I, I have to pause it on something. But there's no other tapes I can use. We've gone through the, the petting zoo and then like the, the birthday one. The clock? Well, the clock we've done for other things. 
Um, I'm not too sure. Yeah, we already did this one too. Fuck. Um, there's nothing here I can do to make a tornado. No new notes or anything like that. And the clock clues are on a tape he doesn't have anymore. Yes, correct. And I still don't know where the... Fuck that little... Oops. She was here. I wonder if I can, like, open any of these... Like, I should have, like, open a box or something like that with these, right? You think that would work? You know what? Meh. <sighs> like, can I lift you up and push you near the window? Fuck. I guess you're gonna have to piss her off so she kills you. I don't know how the fuck I'm gonna be able to do that. Do I say I'm not gonna take care of the cat? I'm gonna watch the whole thing again and pay attention. Hi, friends. I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Ba. Wooly just made ba. an animal sound. He said ba because he is a sheep. Can you make a sound like a sheep? No. Nah. That's great! You sound just like Wooly. <laughs> <laughs> wow, yeah. You sound just like me. So, let me run this by again and see what happens. Okay, same thing. Nothing changed. Got it. Keep continuing forward. Zoo. There are lots of animals here to pet and play with. It's fun to spend time with animals. They are very different from people. They look different and they don't talk like people. Amanda, I'm an animal and I- Animals don't talk, silly. <laughs> look at these signs. Let's make sounds like the animals on the signs. Are you ready? I'm gonna pause A the pig. says, Meh, meh. A chicken says. A pig says. Blink. I just found the viral TikTok and video about the dude who straight up shows his asshole. Hi, creepy. What the fuck? <laughs> Alright, so I didn't do anything as expected. I didn't think it would. How are you doing tonight, Creepy? Ready to protest? Animals make funny sounds. Courtesy to Wink? Oh my god. The pig scene's not okay. Animals have family Do you too. have a family? Let's go Whoa. see one of the animal families. I want to see the chickens. Can you show me where the chickens are? No, I can't. That's not where they are. Don't you know what a chicken looks like? I want to go look at the chicken. Oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Great! Let's go see the silly chicken. What a cute family. <laughs> Having a family is nice. I see a mommy chicken and baby chickens. Oh, it was the actual outside. Damn it. And I 
<laughs> it twitched. I see a daddy chicken. Look at the chickens. Do you know what the daddy is called? Um, the daddy is called. It's not rooster. What can I put? Mm. Twister. No, that's not what they're called. Try. Boom. Let's go. I did it by accident. Full frontal cock, daddy cock. <sighs> I don't know why the fuck that worked, but I'll take it. Well, I didn't do that. That's got to be Blizzard. I would assume, right? Again. The daddy is called a rooster. The mommy is a hen, and the babies are chicks. Some mommies eat their babies. Yum yum. 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 Okay. Let's go see some more animal families. Where should we go next? I think it's time to visit the sheep. <laughs> can you tell me where we can find the sheep? Okay, let's go! What the fuck kid show is this? Look at the nice sheep family. All the sheep are right where they belong. <laughs> Got it. I'm assuming this is a blizzard. I can't really tell. It's not. There's some. It looks like it. Good like tidal wave or something. I bet you I have to piss off. I have to do a bunch of dumb shit. Hi, little kitten. Where is your family? Looks like this kitten is all by herself. How do you What if you choose you spiders feel? instead? Oh god. She must be so scared. There's nobody to love her. Yep, it just changed it. There is no <laughs> one to help her. Will you help the lonely kitten? Will you please help the lonely kitten? Won't you help the lonely kitten? Won't you help the lonely kitten? Won't you help the lonely kitten? What the fuck? Won't you help the lonely kitten? What the fuck was that? Oh, I pissed her off. Time to die. Thank you, anonymous gunshot biddies. Damn it. God. Alright, let's try again. What the fuck? Well. Alright. So, uh... That wasn't the right thing to piss her off with. Oh, look! It gave me the tapes back. Wait, in the kitchen, though? That's not what I want. This is, um... Is it Guts? Oops. Guts. Nickelodeon Guts. Global Guts. I'm gonna get her. I'm gonna get her. I'm gonna get her. Fucking bitch. No. Uh. Fucking batteries? What are those for? 
<laughs> oh my god. The battery's for you? Oh! Do not get Blabot wet. Okay. Not too sure what you're supposed to be doing yet. We're no longer in Kansas anymore. <laughs> Disgusting! Um, okay, so let me go get the other tape. Because I have a feeling I have to complete that little thing there. Oh, what is the family? Yeah, this is the right one. Uh, you just chill out there. Did I set up for the event? What event, Brian? Oh, the um Hi, friend. with the uh, with Team Roar? I did. I'm Wooly. Ba. Ba. I just made an animal sound. He said ba because he is a sheep. The Can event. Can you make a sound like a sheep? That's great. You sound just like Wooly. <laughs> <laughs> wow, yeah. You sound just like me. Yeah, yeah, I see a thunderstorm warning. At a petting zoo. Oh, wait. There are lots of Fuck. That's not where they are. Don't you know what a I want to go look at the chicken. Can you click anywhere else, please? Great. Let's go. I've been trying to practice in the games. Oh, yeah, I, I really what need to as well. Ribbon. You're going to bed, friend. I'll leave a lurk. Thank you, Meg. Have a lovely evening. Sleep well. I'll talk to you soon. And I see. I see a daddy chicken. Look at the chickens. Do you know what the daddy is called? I had to, like, do a bunch of bullshit here. what they're called. Try. What the fuck? Oh, god damn it. Good evening. How are you? Fuck, I forgot. Yeah, I gotta go back and do the other one first. Alright, let's just fast forward through this without causing my downfall. Oops, wrong button. It's a rooster. The daddy is called a rooster. The mommy is a hen, and the babies are chicks. Some mommies eat their babies. So far, I know Crab Game will yeah, have a little yeah. issue with, but Fall Guys, okay. I feel I'm decent at. Yeah, Fall Guys, I'm okay at. Family. Crab Game, I've never played. Where should we go next? I think it's time to visit the sheep. <laughs> can you tell me where we can find the sheep? Yeah, this way. Ew, I don't want to see those. They're scary. Oh, what about these? I don't want to go near... There it is. Okay. So that's how we get the flooding warning. And that's how we wrap it up. All right, fine. We'll go to the sheep. Okay, let's go. And alone. Jesus Christ. No one to help her. So we need to have practice runs with the people who are you playing to prep for it. Oh, for sure. Agreed. And I will help the cat. That way you don't get freaked out at me. We're all happy. That comes out. I then pick it back up. Put it back in, and now we play through the game. Now we get this done. Hi, friends. Bam, bam. I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Ba. Wooly just ba. made an animal sound. He said ba because he is a sheep. Because he is a sheep. Can you sound like a sheep? That's great. You sound just like Wooly. <laughs> <laughs> wow, yeah. You sound just like me. Severe thunderstorm warning is first. The thunderstorm goes. Tornado is next. The silly chickens. Having a family is nice. I see a mommy chicken 
and baby chickens. And I see, I see a daddy chicken. Look at the chickens. Do you know what the daddy is called? <laughs> no, that's not what they're called. Try Tornado warning. Perfect. Spin again, it goes to the top, and it's definitely a flood or something, because it's got the blue waves I can see. And now we know how to get there. Again. Rooster. The daddy is called a rooster. The mommy is a hen, and the babies are chicks. Some mommies eat their babies. Yum, yum. Okay, let's go see some more animal families. Where should we go next? I think it's time to visit the sheep. <laughs> can you tell me where we can find the sheep? Ew, I don't want to see those. They're scary. I don't want to go near... Got it. Blooding. That was fucking gross. Night's forecast. Everything rots episode? Oh, God. Here, go over there for a second. Thank you. We have to flash through the rest of this. Okay, let's go! Uh, alone? Yes. There we go. Alright. Alright, new tape. Hi, Ken. I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. What's that smell? What do you think is making that bad smell? It's the moldy sandwich. I thought we did this one before. No, that looks fine. Are you doing this on purpose? What is making that bad smell? Um, there's organs. You're not seeing the organs there? Uh. Yee, you! You're right! Do you know what the opposite... Alright, hold on. What's behind me before we go any further here? Nothing yet? All right, maybe we have to go through the whole tape. Bit of alive is. Look at the tree stump. If it's not alive, what is it? I don't think we should be talking about this. Are you afraid to think about it? Dead uh, is the opposite of it alive. It just completely Good takes job. over. When an animal dies, it rots too. It looks like this kitten is in big trouble. What the it fuck? It will die before anyone can help it. Should we help the kitten? Yes. Uh. What the fuck? Meet a tragic end? Oh no. Oh, so that's one ending. What the fuck? So there's ten more achievements to get on this game? Holy fuck. You got butchered, I suppose. Yeah. Oh shit, it's 1.30. Oh. <laughs> Alright, um... Maybe we'll, maybe we'll come back to this um, and get the second half of stuff. Because there's... We got a... Uh, we got about half of the uh, achievements. I'm just curious about... Uh, 
how to get around like, that was just weird tv just like gave out yeah come back to this there's more endings yeah there definitely is i kind of love this game it's it's very funny um and it's also creepy as fuck <laughs> cool all right um yeah i need to i need to i need to wrap up i need to wrap up so that's what we're gonna do oh so tonight was fun um i'm up a little bit later than i thought it was going to be but it's not a big deal i technically have to work tomorrow but i'm on call so i'm just gonna wait to hear from any problems that uh my coworker can't handle tomorrow um Ooh. I see butt cheek is on. Thank you, Mo. Appreciate you. And I'm glad you were able to hang out with us. Oh, you knock it on the door. You're gonna go to bed now? You go to bed. <laughs> um I see that butt cheek is on. He's been on for a little over an hour. God damn it, Riz. I hope you have a good sleep, pal. Thank you, Sass. I hope you have a lovely evening as well. Also, we get to play more Outlast soon. It's been too long. I need more therapy. Um. Yeah, let's uh, let's get this raid uh kicked over to Butt Cheek Bo. He's a good friend of the channel, and he's also an OG member of Channel Thirteen along with myself. If you haven't, uh, you know subscribe to that channel on youtube yet you probably should links in chat for you i want to be borned yes of course we must be borned all right here we go kicking this off here comes the raid messages for you so if you are a subscriber that uh that top line with the uh the jug poggers face you can actually use that one i'll put it in the chat one more time otherwise feel free to use the red raid symbols or anything else really for that matter um and definitely give me a follow on the uh the other four platforms you can find me on so there's youtube which has uh vods uh, completely unabridged unedited just tossed right up you'll see those as long as shorts um if you're more of a TikTok user, you can still just catch the YouTube shorts on TikTok. Twitter, I'm as active as I can be. Thanks, Elon Muskrat. Uh, and Discord is our home away from home. We all hang out there. So if you're not a part of it, you should just come be a part of it. Come hang out with us. Get into some funny conversations. And uh, you know, share some goofy-ass memes. Satan, I guess you could use that too. <laughs> Muskrat, yes, of course. Very good, very evil. Uh, but yeah, that's gonna do it. Let's go hang out with Bud Cheek. Drop him a follow if you haven't yet. Please check out Channel 13 Horror if you haven't yet. Um, I look forward to being back, um, tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. Bramble tomorrow. I'll see you then. Peace.